Two going three. Sold. How do hello, we hello. have a like? I don't know. What's <laughs> up, everyone? Hi. Hi, everyone. Hello, and welcome to my channel. Our channel. Our channel. It's called Our Jewelry Addiction, and maybe I should retitle that. Our Jewelry Addiction. My name is Tanya. This is Tasha, my daughter, and welcome. Um, welcome. There's three people in the house. Let me get up and running over here and see what's up. We just decided to come on and say, hey, figure we do a quick little... And... Vanessa, hi, friend. Hello. I don't have my good. I don't have. Oh gosh, Tasha. How yeah, am I gonna read? <laughs> How? Lisa, Topaz, Jim, Pandora, hello. Kelly. Hello. All right, let's go on here and let's do this Jim, live. Pandora, Kelly. Hello. All right, let's go on here and let's do hello. this. Live. Oh yeah, I gotta Kelly, turn this down. <laughs> Shut her up. Hey everyone! Hey hey hey! Let me get the live chat going over here. Oh, we're in. Yep. Okay. Gotta... I still don't have proper glasses. Stormy's here. Hi, Stormy. Stormy's my my daughter, my stepdaughter. It's, uh, and I'm babysitting tomorrow. I do got the girls. I'll pick them up tomorrow and Wednesday. I did say yes to that, but I will get them. Don't you worry. You're at the dentist. <laughs> Stormy's at the dentist? No, hello, strangers is. Oh, good for you. That's the best way. <laughs> I need to go to the dentist. Seriously. No, I like doing that. When I'm in places that I don't like to be, I'll download, like, Candy Crush real quick or watch YouTube. I'm going to go try to find some better glasses. Tasha, entertain them. Hello. Give the people something. Show them, say hello. Give a, give a dance. A dance. How is everybody doing today? Hi, everybody. Okay, I need to put in. I found something better. Oh, Tasha, what are you telling? Trying to put this. I just want to clear something up. <laughs> um, the whole underwear thing yesterday. It sounded so weird. I kind of watched a little bit of that playback. <laughs> she, I was like, yeah, you know, she had been wearing them for a long time. That's not what I meant. <laughs> She had been wearing that type of boxer brief for a very <laughs> long time, and they just looked comfortable. And yes, yeah, I, I think I stole one out of her clean laundry, not once that she'd been wearing for a long time. And they were like, you know, like the shorty pants, the um, like the Daisy Duke ones. They're they're really comfortable. I like them way better than underwear. I did not approve this message. <laughs> I just wanted to clarify to you guys. No, I did not steal. Well, I kind of stole them, but they were clean. <laughs> Look so much alike. You both are beautiful. Thank you. Hello, strangers. That's awfully nice. <laughs> that did not translate that way. Oh, good. Because I was, I, I was like, I watched it just for a little bit uh, when I got into bed. And I was like, oh, God, that sounded horrid. And she's like, Mom, like... You know, like I like literally stole her underwear. I guess I did out of the clean dryer. I don't know. Sorry, Tasha. <laughs> We're still talking I mean, about I've this. I've never accidentally put on her underwear, so I don't understand well, how she can accidentally like put on mine. I like a certain mine. kind of underwear, and those she. <laughs> my son wears the same kind too, and they just both also never accidentally put on his. Well, no, but you guys swear by them, and I just I thought I'd try them. <laughs> she had bought a new pack of Kenneth Cole ones. They got little rainbows around the top, Kenneth Cole, and they were shorty shorts, and I was like, I must have a pair of those. And I'm so glad you all know what type of underwear I wear now. <laughs> <laughs> so glad. <laughs> well, they are much more comfortable than anything that might ride up your... Yeah. 
Chris is just sitting over here shaking She's her head. She's shaking her head. I'm sorry, guys. I, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Comfy is good. I love my shorts. Right? <laughs> hello, hello, strangers. Did it retracted her message? Whatever it might have said. <laughs> I'm sweating now. I'm like, oh God, what am I talking about? If we could have here? retracted the, this conversation. All right, let's start this over, Tasha. Let's delete it. <laughs> this one's live. <laughs> we can't restart this one. Oh my gosh, oh, man. that's funny. We are we all fulfilled now. now. <laughs> Glad we could do that for you. <laughs> My glasses are literally fogging up because I'm just <laughs> laughing and, yeah, now I'm having a hot flash. <laughs> what have you done? I don't know. Marissa's <laughs> over <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, thanks, Mom. <laughs> All right. We got 15 in the house. Eight thumbs up. We're just going to come here for a minute. Um, why don't you tell them what we did today, Tasha? So. Ooh. I was going to go see my friend who, um, where I got the jewelry from the other day, and Tasha said, I want to go with you. And what yes. happened? Well, we, we went and we got lots of stuff. Lots of very, very cool stuff today. So. Yeah, I let Tasha pick out some stuff. Um, because I figured I have a good eye. And it was funny, everything I was looking at, she was looking at. So we, we have very similar taste. She did pick up a couple of things that I hadn't really, and I was like, ooh, yeah, that's a good one. That's good. You want to just show them real quick? You want a little sneak peek? Give them a sneak preview. A little sneak preview. Just a sneak preview. This is not for today, but we will be bringing it real soon. Look at that. That's a pendant, sterling silver. Very cool. I love this one. What else did we get? Sneaky peaky. What? Yes. Egg yolk amber, butterscotch amber in the raw. Look at that modernist, beautiful piece of jewelry. Yes, right? That's so nice. Hello, hello, Anna. Here's a few really cool ones that we found. Poison ring. With the face. Whoa. Gorgeous, right? Oh, I love that amber too. Yes, I do. Show, show, show. Wow. Yeah, we went shopping. I spent a little bit of money today. We, we spent a little bit of money today. But it was more of a... Um, that one's really interesting. This is a very modernist piece. We just missed that because I do not have to pick up my granddaughter today. I'm Look at that. Comes on here and says you do. Oh, I, she said Tuesday, Wednesday. <laughs> <laughs> I have it down for Monday... When Tuesday, Wednesday, or something that like that. Oh yeah, look at that one, Liz. Um, well, this is a seven. That's cool, right? I just I my daughter's like, Mom, that looks like it needs just like a little charm on it or something. I Hi, cool. D. It's Hi. just a neat. Yeah, we picked out some really neat jewelry over there yeah. today. Just a bunch of like interesting rings, and I think we found a cool. Couple bracelets, pendants. Mm. Uh, oh, Liz, look. Huh? I found this over there today. It will go with the ring I got from you last night. Pretty cool. That one's neat too. That's a really neat one. Modernist stuff. Yeah, I, I, we, we both had similar taste. I was like, please, Tasha, help me pick out some stuff. I think that'd be great to have a second eye there. And um, the guy's got bags of this stuff. Literally. Yeah, and he just dumped them gladly for us into the tray. He's a really cool guy. He's he's neat. I like this one. Look at that. It's like the queen, but it's hand pounded. Pretty cool. This one's cool. It says I like that one too. Let's see. It's hard to get this one to focus. There you go. Turn it. Hi, Nixie. Wednesday, Thursday, LOL. Okay, Stormy. It's in my, it's on my thing. I think it's actually 
Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday uh, that I already have it programmed in my phone. But I'll pick them up. Don't you worry. I won't leave them at the school all night. Plus, you're going to send me a reminder, I'm sure. <laughs> Sidetrack Sally over here. Or Stacy Spacey, like Tasha likes to call me now. Little bypass ring. This you didn't thing show is them huge. all. You nope. did not show them all. Look at this thing. That's neat. That's a really like cool brutalist. Like, turn your finger this way. What? Someone sold one like this really recently that I just saw. There was this one with the Trinity on the side. Would you have any Baltic amber? Um, Baltic. Baltic amber. Got a little piece of amber there. There's another one. Um, this one was cool again with the with the people holding up the thing there. That's like a woman or whatever. This this reminds me a lot of one that we got um, last week, and there's like a person holding that up. This is not cool. That's a neat one. I like that a lot. Then we have the little Siam. Have you ever seen a Siam ring? I mean, I find a lot of Siam jewelry, but this is the first one that I've ever seen that was ring form. And it's like on the inside too, which leads me to believe that this bale or the, um, the ring portion was added to whatever this was originally. That's what I'm thinking. And look at the design on that. Oh, God, it's not focusing because it's focusing on your face. Your cute face, Tasha. I'll get it out of there. There's also this one. It's just a silver band, but it has, like, turquoise, and then malachite, and onyx, and is that one jade? No, it's like, I forget what it's called. It's got purple and green in it. I'm not sure. It's got a bunch of like Gosh, lines of inlaid stone. I really liked it. It's very heavy. Look at that one. Another cool design. Just neat. But he had some cool jewelry. He this really did. One. And we only saw a small fraction of his jewelry. It's another like, uh, this one is kind of see-through. You can see it's it's green um, and it's almost like glass or something. I mean, I'm sure it's some sort of a stone, but I can see through it from the light on the inside here. What's happening? Zeus, stop that. That's a neat ring though. It's a very cool pendant. Oh, I already showed that one. Did you already show that one? No. It's just silver. It looks like a, just a, like a cabochon or whatever, like a stone, but it's not, it's just silver. We got 30 people in the chat. Mmm, those were lovely too. Hi. Lizzie and Louie, hello, welcome. There was just a couple more, you know, just some simple, like, bypass kind of rings and I liked this one it's got like the um, medical symbol in the middle it's a vintage it's cool oh that's almost military on the side so I'll bet you as a military um, nurse and military nurse or doctor or something yeah yeah we had fun shopping hey where'd all the rings go let's put them back because this was full and look Tasha kept the ring did you test your jewelry i bought it from a jewelry guy who buys he buys gold and silver and that's what he does for a living i didn't have to test it he's already mm -hmm. tested it. i mean i'm not even worried about his stuff and, if, and i will test it right it. in front of you but um yeah i'm not worried about anything i've ever gotten from him no not at all oh did she show you this one this is this is awesome. 
Yeah, Tasha's wearing the ring. At, yeah, it's, and she loves it. It's like she it hasn't just, taken it so off. Comfortably. I can't wear it at work, so this I have to have it off on the. This is days. really cool right here, too. Love this one. Yeah, we had fun shopping over there today, but I am most excited about this. This has been sitting in his case for a minute. He was asking a pretty penny for it, and I wasn't very interested. But after I bought that ring off of Makeup Zombie yesterday, it's like, yes, it's got exactly the same. Um, it's going to be a beautiful marriage with the ring together. I had to get it. So I kind of splurged on this one a little bit because look at that. It's just, it's handmade, just chunky. I mean, it's cool. Really Thank fun. you, Lizzie and Louie really fun very pretty such it was yeah we had a good time we're still missing two rings tasha where'd they go there they are that was all her <laughs> i didn't know all right what's first what are we selling first my dear um why don't we just start it off with one of these do it all right we got a nice little jewelry bag I reached, lots of fun stuff in here. Yeah, I reached into the... Um, do you want to switch me chairs again? Cause, yeah. Because that's how we do. I like my... This is uh, how I roll. Ah! All right. Trump. Better. All right. I'm going to go ahead and point the camera down. Bye-bye. Starbucks in hand. Yeah. Frappuccino. Cappuccino, or what is it? It's what did I get? A frappuccino. That's your An ring. espresso That's frappuccino. So this is stuff, you guys. I told you I still had a Ben sitting here. I just reached in there, and I pulled out a bunch of stuff that I thought. I mean, it's still about a quarter of the way full, and I do kind of just want to get it gone. So this is just going to be a bead lot, and this is mostly pearl stuff. This is a stretch bracelet. It's got the little bobblies. It's got crystals, ABs, just some stones. It's all like, well, that one might, I think these look like they're plastic, this one here, but the rest of these are glass. Definitely. D. Miller. There's this nice pearl and glass bead necklace and it comes with a matching set of earrings yeah these are actually natural pearl from what i remember because yeah, they feel like they're natural yeah they are I, that's what i wrote on the bag anyway um so on this kids we are going a starting bid of five dollars we're just gonna we're gonna play that game again how do we do that tasha did i do it what <laughs> oh <laughs> there we go we're going to do a starting bid of $5 on this whole lot. And this is included in it. And it's in the bag. It's stapled shut. Um, you can see there's some staples here because I didn't want it to get all scuffed up. But that is a bracelet. And this is the necklace that goes with it. And you showed this bobbly bit. You showed that. No, I didn't show this one yet. Oh, this one's cool. Oh, look at! I didn't even see that before. Mm -hmm. There's like those horses. Yeah, there's like seahorses or. I think are they seahorses? Well, yeah, that's a seahorse. It looks like a seahorse's head with the the I way. The other one just looked like a horse. But maybe well, that's why they call them seahorses because they look a lot alike. Well, they do look like horses. Oh, that's cute. It's almost got like a. Look at that cap, little horse. Yeah, that's a cute little bobbly bracelet. Also, um, all those look so fun, right? There's this one. This one, that's cute. It's got a bunch of crowns on it. And it's got the big bobbly pearls on top. Yeah, it's got big pearls. And then this is what? And again, these are just things that have been sitting in this box for a very long time. I can tell how long because look at the shape of this bag. Otherwise, it'd be in a brand new little thing. Hi. Stormy still in the house, is she? She's probably, yeah, she's taking her little breaky. Um, 
And that's just a cute little bracelet. These are all glass and crystal. All right. That's everything. And a cute little pair of earrings there. Going once for $5. Going twice for $5. $5. And we are, where's our bells? Right here. Oh, Diana Balsh is in for $5. Would anyone like to come back with a $7 bid on that? Who is this? What is this? This one looks like something. I got to do a proper inspection of this. Got the toggle cloth. I do not see a name, but that is awfully, awfully cute. Yes, we will ship to Canada. Just the shipping prices are different in Canada, so we just have to get the price and yeah. then we'll send you the price of the shipping for that. So, what's been happening? We've been doing a marathon. Today is the last day of the marathon. We're going to be doing shipping tomorrow and Wednesday. Um, and if you have spent $200 over the duration of this five days, your shipping is free in the United States. And I will cover half the cost for the shipping um, to Canada. Because the last few heavy packages I've sent there have been in the uh, $30, $40 to $70 range for a lot of jewelry. So um, it's quite an expense. And then if you're only purchasing one or two items here in the United States... Um, that can go into just a little, you know, padded envelope type thing, and, and it's five dollars for shipping. So if you're if you're new here, um, is it Sharon Bolt? Uh, you could please email. We've left the link up at the top of the page. You can email us. Make sure you give us your YouTube name, um, your shipping address, and your uh, yeah. That did look like J Crew. You're absolutely right. That's why I thought it was something. Okay. Looks like it's going once to Diana Balsh for $5. Do you need my info to be able to bill me? Not at all, dear D. We've got you. We, we know where you live and everything. <laughs> Pretty soon we might just come knock on your door because I think you're family by now. <laughs> um. All right, we are going three times and sold to Diana Bulls for $5. You'll enjoy that. We're going to do one more of these, guys, just to get it out of the way, because I had put together a couple of bags. Why not? Uh-oh, better be girl. Huh? <laughs> That's what some Linda said to <laughs> Um, I found this in that bag, and this looks to me like Miriam Haskell. I'm not going to sell this right now until, uh, but it definitely has a very Miriam Haskell look to me. I need someone, um, yeah, like, I don't know. It's on, a, it's on chain, but those pearls look very much like Miriam Haskell. So, D knocking on your door. <laughs> always welcome. I'll even leave you a key under the mat. Dee, thank you. You know what? I've always had that open door policy. As a matter of fact, my friend that's in England right now, uh, she'll be here in a couple of days. I believe she already has a key to my house from last time she was here. Um, and as do many of my other friends, they have a key to my house. Because <laughs> if I'm not here and they're here from out of town or something, you're always welcome, right? Yeah. Shoot, I got an empty bedroom right now. Anyone's welcome. That's how I roll. Oh, that for five bucks, right? That's such a good deal. Tell me you still um, have invoicing to do from a couple nights ago and I haven't received one yet. Tell Linda Cook? Email. Huh? Tell her to email. Can you email Linda? Email us. Well, all of those were five dollars in. Oh, she said she pending? has. Because it says it's pending. Oh. I'll email. Yeah. Okay. All right. She, um, Marissa's gonna email you right now. Um, yeah. We'll we'll get you squared away. Don't you worry. Yeah. No worry. No worries. 
All right, someone, a lot of, actually, a few people have been requesting, like, glass beaded bracelets. So I just, these were all in that box down there. I might even do another lot of this stuff and just grab it and see what's in there. Just see what's happening. That's very pretty. I love those beads. These are all glass beads. So this is a lot. Oh, sorry. I have Sharpie all over my hands. Oh, that looks... That, that's like natural gemstone. There's crystals and stones and... That could be a sterling finding. I don't even know. And I, I don't even care. I'm just, you know, just clearing out the bottom of the box. So we have one bracelet. I'm going to do this one as a... Um, let's see. Sterling bit. Yeah, we're going to do a starting bed at $5 on this one as well. More glass crystal beads. Orange. I love orange. It's my favorite color. If y'all didn't know, I may have mentioned it before. Orange and turquoise together, actually. That's like my favorite combo. Uh, just some... This is cute. It's got different little rhinestones. Oh, bummer. That's missing a rhinestone right there. Er, retract. This is cute. Copper findings. And it's got these cute little beads. I tried to put my address in and it says address not found. Oh, my goodness. My jewelry addiction 55 at gmail.com well that's my email address my jewelry addiction 55 at gmail.com yeah that's um right i thought so too d i'm glad you're paying attention um yeah that is the email address so i'm not sure Look, i can do it again um There you go. What's a good trivia question? Uh, something I just said, and Dee was listening. <laughs> well, you're not going to win the prize. This is new, <laughs> new on card. Uh, I, me too. Yes, it's it's a great look. This is cute. I don't know. Okay. Is this Christmassy? I guess. It's all glass beads. It, this one's on a stretch. This one's also on a stretch. Oh, it's cute. It's got butterflies. Nixie's in at $5. This is a great deal. Cute glass beads. This one's pretty. Ooh, look. Ooh, look. It's got the really lovely beads. Oh, Ducky Jones. And the pinned address. Oh. Is that? I just put it in from what was there. Well, J E W E L E R I. I see what's <laughs> happening. Okay. I should just not be Let me unpin that message. <laughs> and. I'm sorry. It's just, Tasha's new to jewelry. Yeah, I don't know how to spell the word jewelry, apparently. Oops. I try. Okay. Well, there's this beautiful little bracelet. It's got little glass beads in it that are all colored. There. I'll have Tasha um, pin that to the top when... How oh, do you yeah, do it? Do. Oh, pin message. the message. There we go. There you go. Sorry about that, guys. Okay. J-E-W-E-L. Yeah. Jewel. 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 Editor. Can't help it. Thank you, Ducky. <laughs> well, thank you. I appreciate that because we may never never have found that. Oh gosh, that was awful. My thing was. That's I like awesome. This, one. this one's super cute. That's, no, that's not more. That's more than super cute. Look at the glass on there. It's it's. I remember Don at Hudson Vintage talking about this. Do you see how it's got a blue? Uh, it's not just pink. There's different colors going through that do you see that one that one's got three colors it's pink blue and green and this is i'm pretty sure this one is gold filled look at that it's gorgeous gorgeous and it has the safety chain 
It's vintage. It is signed. What does it say, Tasha? <gasps> Where's the loop? Oh my gosh. Loop. Oh my goodness. There we go. Oh, this is actual Sarah Coventry. Vintage Sarah. Sarah Coventry. Very cute. This one's cool. Did you already show this one? Yeah, I showed that a second ago. I like this one. I will email you. Awesome. We got Ashley in at 12 looking for 14. Ooh, this is pretty too. That looks like some sort of a stone there. And then these are like opalite crystals almost. They, they have that opal opalite look and they're faceted with like AB. Sorry for the nails, guys. And then it's got a cute little tassel. This one is cute. It's stretchy. It's got a good stretch on it. It's very cute and sweet. $12 looking for $14. We got new on card Christmas coming up with little Santa Claus. We got a jingle bell. And what do we got over here? We have a present and a Christmas tree and a big candy. Yeah, that's a great lot. Did you show this one? No. This, uh, cool this is just vintage rhinestone. It's in great shape. All the stones are there. This is beautiful. This one is like really beautiful. Wow. I like how they did that. So it's got big crystals and then it's got a whole bunch of dangly crystals and then it's got a station where it's just one and then it's got a whole bunch more dangles and then another station and more dangles. And we're at 12 looking for 14. And we have more. What else we got? Well, there's this one. This one says stay positive on it. Oh, nice. Who's that by? Is there any it name? It has inside? that on it. Oh, know. that's one of those. That's one of those. Oh, who is that? Is that Origami Owl? Do you guys know? It, I mean, I've always assumed that was origami because it looks like an origami. Does anyone know? I'll let you know if we received it. Uh, Sharon wants to know if we received her address. Sharon Bolt. Anyone yes. know what that is? Yeah, we got you. Yeah, we got you, Sharon. Thank you. Thank you. Well, anyways, it's got that. And then there is this one, another stretchy. And lastly, we have the sponge coral inlay. We're at $12, looking for $14. Sponge coral inlay. All right, here we go. And a little wood number with some leopard print. Oh, is that wood? Oh, I don't know if that's wood. It might be plastic. And so you got all of these lovely bracelets for $12 going once to Ashley Sweden. $12 going twice to Ashley Sweden. Oh, did we say that there was one of these in there too? And this, and this, and Tasha's already put some away. And looks like we are going three times and sold to Ashley for twelve dollars. This is let's make a good deal. <laughs> yeah, we just gotta get rid of this stuff, D. What am I gonna do? You guys wanna duke it out over a ring? <laughs> Tasha, I'll let you pick a ring. Ring ring. Ring ring ring. Um, why don't we go with, why not that one? That sounds great. All right. I'm going to let Tasha do this. We'll see how good she's getting at this. It always makes me nervous when she says stuff like that. Oh, but <laughs> we know. All right. We so know it, you do real well. This one has a nice little, little square thing on it with, I'm not sure if it's this rectangular. Is a, rectangular. I'm not sure if this is a letter. I don't think so. Or I think it's just squiggle. It's the same upside down either way you turn it. Yeah. 
She sounds like a pro, right, Ashley? Yeah, she's she's good. It's got these cool little guys on the side that are like holding it up, kind of like I think a ring that we had about a week right. ago. Right. It almost reminds me of the in Rio, the Jesus that's up on the side of the mountain in Rio. That's what it kind of reminds me of. I mean, I know it's not, but it's very cool design. Mm -hmm. Really neat. Let's see. On the inside. Here's the mandrel. And here's the loop. I actually don't see a whole oh, lot of Oh, let's get the lottery tickets. Here. Tasha, we were feeling lucky today. and We won $4. $4, and we spent two, four, six. I was going for twenty thousand. Seven, eight, nine, ten. We spent eleven and one four, so we're out. Uh, we're out seven dollars. This ring sits right at about a six and a half, but it fits this one pretty well, which is about an eight. So, did you we, know, did we get whose name is in Ashley here? Sweden? Where'd it go? I haven't done it yet. You told me to show a piece of jewelry. Oh, okay. You go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Ashley, that was For at $12, $12 right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. And then it is one inch this way and a half inch this way. I'm going to test it, but let's start the bidding out on this one at $25. Okay. Tasha says the starting bed on that ring is $25. It's a lot of pressure. <laughs> Especially when mom's sitting here. I can move. Gail's in at $25. She likes it enough. Thank you, I mean, Gail. That is going on very buttery. Oh, we forgot to pick up more 18K acid. I know. From we him. told him. Oh, I forgot. Darn it. And there you go. That is lighting up very blue. So that's definitely going to be sterling silver. And where is your scale? Scale. I had to clean this today. It had a bunch of verdigris on it. And I just, it's broken. It's missing some stones, but it's stunning. Great for crafting. So it was just full of green verdigris everywhere. And I doused it in ketchup before we left the house. And I came back. All the verdigris is gone. There's still a little rough looking stuff. And it's like just about crumbling. But isn't that beautiful? Ketchup does wonders. With See, that. I told you. She's like, Thank you guys. Like a pro. So this ring is coming in at 8.3 grams. I don't think it really matters about the weight. It's just oh, the just style of the ring. Let make sure they have all the information they might possibly want. Yeah. It's definitely it, it like a modernist really nice. style look to it. It's very modernist. And then it's got these two little balls right underneath the swirl design. There's a ball on either end underneath the cage. Show them underneath. We got Gail in at 25 looking for 27. How y'all doing today? Uh -oh. All right, we got Galen at 25. Looking for 27. Got no interest in 27. Looks like it's going once to Gail. Oh, $25. Going twice to Gail at $25. Looking for 27. We're looking for 27. And you guys want to we don't five. have anybody interested in five. Oh, D Miller, you came back with that 27. All right. Looks like we're now looking for 29. Any interest in at $29? Oh, Gail A, you came back with that $29. How do you feel about that, D? I think I just need to let Tasha take over and 
I, I'm just going to step away. <laughs> Tasha does good. Is it Hebrew? Hebrew. It could be, but it, it, it doesn't have any marks on the inside that I can see. So I see. don't really know. Um, what I thought was different about not being maybe so much, uh, like even if it was in Hebrew, I don't know of anything that looks identical either way you turn it. So it doesn't matter which way you turn it, it's going to end up looking exactly the same. And I don't know if that's a symbol. I think this is more of just a modernist style piece, but those are awesome. I mean, those are definitely arms and it looks like, looks like a body holding holding up the world you know or whatever that is we got gail in at 29 need that starbucks 31 oh, 31 Miller. today i'm actually not drinking starbucks i decided to make a tea at home you have starbucks this morning okay okay like right now currently okay i i had starbucks at 4 30 this morning who would not have starbucks at 4 30 this morning all right, everybody's throwing me under the bus right now. It's cool. All right, let's see. I believe it was, let's see. The, the weight on this one is going to be 8.3 grams. Oh, I hope the dogs don't start going nuts. <laughs> we are currently in at $33 to Gail A, looking for a bid of 35 Wow, Tasha, very impressive. She knows what's up. She don't need me. Is it not Hebrew? It I could mean, it be, Liz. I'm not, not saying. I, I, I'm not 100% sure. It just, to me, with the sides, it just looks more like a modernist piece. It, I mean, it very well could be, but it's exactly the same either way you turn it. So... The, it Bless feels really heart. nice on my hand. Like it fits really comfortably with the fingers around the side. Uh, it's not too heavy. It it just feels really nice. Like, does it feel like a nice weight, Tasha? Like on your hand? Yeah. Gail says yes. I mean, it, yeah. You're both in. D came back at 35, and Gail came back at 37 real quick. It's it's a super comfy. It feels very well made. It's it's clearly well made. Yeah, that's that's like an artisan piece to me. It looks. I don't know. Out of all of them, I I really yeah. liked that one. Thirty-seven. Damn Pandora. We got a we got a new one in on that one. Thirty-seven dollars. But Gail beat her to it, unfortunately. Oh, so Pandora. Sorry, you, Pandora. There you go. There you she go, came Pandora. back at thirty-nine. 39. All right, I'm back I'm now. now. Got crab cakes out of oh, the oven. Uh, can I want we come a crab over? cake. Oh my that gosh. That sounds so good. That you place know, in Oakers where they have 41 the crab cakes. Gail. Oh my yeah. gosh, I want that now. <laughs> 41 looking for 43. Um, I, I don't know if you guys have a restaurant called Huckleberries over there, but we have a Huckleberries I'm here. Huckleberry. And at Huckleberries, like, I love getting um, Eggs Benedict. Like That's one of my favorite breakfasts. I always get it without the ham. But I a love hollandaise sauce. You can close their eyes at any of them and pick a winner 45 45 you both that, came in just like at the same time on that 45 <laughs> gail is just above you d though on our end but at huckleberries they have a crab cake eggs benedict oh yeah and it is so good it is delicious yum that sounds right, 47 great. of d miller they really also have that. a oh fried gosh we fried got green tomato one Gail too. at 50 Pandora came back at 49 oh. um so we're at $50 now looking for $5 increments if anyone else would like to partake in this lovely ring it got silent in the house real quick they're, they're like wait we got <laughs> dun, <where>? dun, dun. <laughs> $50 going once oh, Pandora's out to D, what, what about Gail you? A looking to see if D Miller wanted to come back D, yes D said absolutely she loves that it looks like a swimmer and a cheerleader a, a swimmer <laughs> and a cheerleader I mean I'll go with it well, like it. what did I read you this morning? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
I love it. <laughs> Gail's at 60. So sweet. Sweet little, Is little letter. Is this considered art deco? Very art deco, I would say. Or, you know, I don't know. I would say more modernist. I mean, it could be, art deco is, is a lot more fluid, like flowy with the, um, well, no, not necessarily. I guess art deco is the really hard curves. I'm thinking art nouveau. I'm sorry. Um, yeah, it could be art deco. Art deco slash... Yeah. Gail's right. out. I mean, Dee's out. out. Gail is in at $60. It looks like we got Gail in at 60 going once. Gail is in 60 going twice. And, and we are sold. Sold. Okay. Congratulations, Gail. Gail A. Gail. And what we read earlier was a very, very sweet email from a very, very sweet lady. Right. Are we not all family now? We just love it here. Yes. 60. Cool ring. I'm just putting cool ring. Because it is a cool ring. Oh, yeah. We don't have our little baggy deal. Thank you very much, Gail. You'll enjoy that ring. It is quite lovely. And I guess I'm just going to pick a ring this time. Or, you know what? Tasha did so good. I'm going to let Tasha. We're going to do another ring. We're probably only going to be here for a little while today, but we just thought we'd bring in a few more items to make up for the Saturday when we, um, you know, had to regroup. <laughs> regroup and um, what is screaming at you, Tasha, of all these lovelies? What is screaming at me? Yeah. I Let's mean, see, see if one is screaming more than the other. Because they're all looking awfully pretty to me. I think this one's really you nice. You like that one? I do. Well, there you go. I, I just... Let's see who this is. Let's see what it says on here. Janine Anderson wants larger size rings. This is ATI 925 China. Which doesn't mean anything bad. And you can test it right now. And again, this is one that came from my friend's gold store. Or it's, like I told you the other day, it's a travel agency. It's a check cashing <laughs> place. And you can go and sell your gold or your silver. And you can buy there, too. Well, and then He's, next door, they also have the restaurant. Yes, it's a, it's a Mexican restaurant that's attached to it. And it's all family. They're all family. And sure. uh, it's, it's a neat little place. Sure, I want sell to do the, the amber, amber ring. ring. You want to do the amber ring? Um, well, do this first. we'll do that one first. We'll do the amber ring next. Since Tasha picked this one, okay. I said it, I said Tasha's choice because she's just. So this is the one that I picked. I really like this ring. It was very pretty. Yeah. It's a little bit smaller. What's the size? Let's see. I don't even know. Well, it fits you. That's probably seven and a half. So this, these petals have got a really nice, like, um, brushed, real brushed finish on the top. Not on the bottom, just on the top. It's really nice. And that looks like, very much like an amethyst in there. Just a light colored amethyst. Give it a little scratch test. It's a beauty. All right, we're going to test this. I'm going to test it back here. And you can yeah, see how just, smoothly that goes on. It just went right on like butter. You just drop it right on there. Yeah, I would never doubt anything that I got from this guy because he just uh, he thoroughly checks. Yeah, everything. he doesn't. He wouldn't. This is all stuff that he's purchased off of people that are coming in off the street selling. So, yeah, there you go. It lit up blue. It's silver. ATI China. I'm not sure who that is, and I don't have my phone right now to look it up. There's a lot of great jewelry designers coming out of China right now and have been for several years now. What What's your starting bet on this, Tasha? You know, I kind of want to start at the same place because I think this is a really nice ring also. Okay. So I want to start at $25 for this one. Tasha says it's a starting bit of $25. We'll, we'll weigh this one. It's also got a good weight to it. Sharon is in at $25. That this, one's this heavy. This one weighs 12.5. This is twice as heavy as the other ring. So that's just uh, at $2 a gram right now. Hey, Gina, what's happening? The Sasha. Sasha. 
It's Tasha, but that's okay. You can call her Sasha. I've always liked the name call, Sasha more. Uh, one of my friends calls used to call her Sushi. <laughs> sushi. So this one sits actually just right above the seven. Here, I'll so tell what you. would that be? That, well, it's just about a seven. I'll tell you, it fit your finger just fine. So I'm a seven, and I can tell you right now, it's flopping down. So this is more of a seven and a half, and this is an eight. And I can't get it past my knuckle. This is an eight, and I can't get it past my knuckle. Well, I can barely get it past, but actually, it fits once I get past my knuckle just fine as an eight. It's very pretty. All right, looks like Lisa likes this ring at twenty-seven dollars. We're looking for a bit of twenty-nine. <laughs> she liked <Jeez>. Sasha. <laughs> I like Sasha better too. And I hate the name Natasha. I'm not okay. Lie. So when I told you guys that my mom named me after an elephant, there was a couple. It was going to be Natasha Pascal or Tanya, and I always wanted to be named Natasha. So when I had my daughter, it was like perfect opportunity to um, use this name that I've always wanted. <laughs> Lisa's in at 31. I, I only hear the name Natasha when I'm in trouble, but like to me, whenever I hear that name, it makes me feel like a princess. And I'm like, I, I just don't fit Natasha's that. Natasha's not a princess. <laughs> like <laughs> Natasha just doesn't work. Sasha, I love that name. Tasha, I mean, I'll deal with it. it it's, it's what I've had. Sasha sounds more feminine to me. I don't know. Actually in Russia, Sasha is a man's name. Oh, it's true, right? Oh, it, oh my gosh, my dogs are going nuts. It's got the brush finish all the way around there. Okay, I'm gonna go handle that situation because they're just acting all sorts. Hey, get in here, you little freak! Come on, come on, come on. Her dogs constantly are doing this. My my dogs very oh my rarely goodness. will leave and bark outside. Got the gardener next door with the blower. No. Oh my gosh, that gas. Uh -huh. Sasha's spicy spy name. Yes, I agree. And my last name is very Russian spy, so, you know, it works. Get it, get it, good girl. All right, we got Lisa F in at 35. We're looking for a bit of 37. Sasha Baron Cohen. <laughs> I like him. Who's that? Sasha Baron Cohen. He's the like actor guy. The actor guy. Yeah, actor guy. <laughs> I don't. I can't. I can't really describe. Lisa F is at thirty-five, looking for thirty-seven. I want to say he's the one from Borat. Oh, I think I think that is him. I or or his name is I also could be Sasha Borat. Borat. Yeah, Gina says yeah, Borat. Okay, yeah, that was an interesting yeah, movie. movie. That was a very interesting <laughs> movie. Ah, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> <laughs> All right, looks like we're going to Lisa F once for $35. Get you in there focused. Looking for 37. Look at how pretty her hands are. She's got them piano long piano fingers too, huh, D? Going twice to Lisa F for $35. Looking for 37. And we are sold to Lisa F for $35. Where'd that pen go? Boop. Lisa F. 35 And for a uh, flower ring. Congratulations. Yes, cone brats. Put her in a bag. Alright, we're supposed to do an amber ring. An amber ring. Okay. We could do two amber rings. How about that? Oh. Separate? No, do whatever, do whatever you want. We'll do them separate. She always gets crazy. Well, I'll let you do it, Tasha. You do such a great job. You do what you want. No, she does better than me, I think. I start real low, and then I sell stuff real low. And Tasha's like, no, Mom, you can't do that. And she does better, so I'll let her do it. <laughs> Ashley says, yay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Okay. Yeah, she does really good. So we got these two amber rings. This is gonna be hard because I <gasps> love this ring. Oh no, Ashley lost the amber chunk out of her ring. Oh bummer. Oh no. That sucks. Well, we have two right here. <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> one's a little bit more yellow, one's a little bit more amber. 
Yeah, this one is really, really cool looking. I want to loop that this one. This one sits at right at about seven and a half in size. That's really pretty, that one. Fits me really nicely. You can see in the back panel. Oh. That's a nice piece of amber. It fits really comfortably. This one's not super heavy. Not at all. Not at all. This one is going to be wow. 2.8 grams. And this one feels about the same size, actually. Also fits really nicely. This one has nice details on the side. <laughs> I'm over here going, doo, 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 look at that. That ring is super cool. Yeah, you could do that one too. This one too? I'll let you do this one after, you can do this one after that one, and then you can go back to that one. I thought we were doing both of them. Okay, we'll do them both. Look. Well, then you can do this one, because I think you need to do See this that? one. I just think you do. This one sits at about seven and a quarter. So it's See actually a little bit smaller than the other one. Oh, are you okay? Yeah. Sorry. What are you doing? Oh, I'm just looking for stuff in here that I can't find. Okay. All right. You got it. Toyota. <laughs> no, we can't close it. Okay. So it looks like this one is going to be about 2.8 grams. I would say if we're going to do both of them together, why don't we start the bidding out? You're wait, gonna, we, we can start. Wait, you're doing both of them together? This is what you said. Well, that's not what I meant. But you can do whatever you want, Tasha. You do it. You do Tell you. Tell me. Boo -boo. Did, did she say it? Did she say it? Somebody somebody, let me know. Am I tripping over here? It's a Freudian slip, Ashley. Who did that? Who did the Freudian what? Who's a Freud? <laughs> Lord Freudian slip, Ashley? Uh, maybe it was me. The Yes, uh, she did. Oh. Thank you, Sharon. Okay, well. Yeah. <laughs> and then I you. And then I said it's okay. It's up to Tasha. Whatever Tasha no wants to do. No backtracking on what you had said. <laughs> Ashley's just trying to stay out of it. She doesn't want to get in the middle. I get it. I don't even care. <laughs> you just Tasha does such a good job. You do whatever you want. I think because both of these are such nice rings, I think maybe starting in at thirty dollars for the two. Oh wow. Okay. So we're okay. Tasha said it's a starting bid of thirty dollars for both. She always makes me nervous when no. she says things hey, Tasha. like, oh, wow. Wow, that's no, <laughs> that's great. Oh, my gosh. We got two in already. Uh, Sharon came in uh, first. Okay, we got 32. We got the two amber rings. That's uh, that's a fabulous deal. 32 looking for 34. There we go. Judith is in at 34. Perfect. We got Ashley Sweden in at 36 and we are looking for $2 jumps. 45 to Sharon. She wants it. Um, okay, Judith's going to have to come back with 47. There we go. Ashley's in at 47 looking for 49. Looking for $49. I'll put them on. Did Tasha show you these? Oh my goodness. <laughs> 50 to Judith. 55, 55 to Ashley. Ashley. We are in $5 increments now. Looking for $60. They're well worth 30, 40 bucks. Sharon's no out. Problem. Oh no. I'm sorry, Sharon. I don't know why that always makes me so feel so bad when people say they're out. <laughs> well, that's just their way of letting you know you're not going to get oh, another bit. Oh, Judith is out. D, okay, I said congrats, on. Amber, when I meant congrats, Ashley. It's because you were looking at the Amber. I get it. All right. It looks like right now we got Ashley Sweden in at 55. We're looking for 60. That's not a bad price. Actually, that's a great price. I'll do that all the time. <laughs> my dogs they're right there all right we got 55 going once looking for a bit of 60 dollars got 
55 going twice. All right. And we're going to say sold to Ashley Sweden for $55. Ding, 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 ding. Woo! I do stuff like that all the time. My phone. I'll constantly like just have my phone in my hand and be like, where's my phone? I, I can't find it anywhere. I do that with my glasses all the time. Oh, she loses her glasses like well, nobody I've ever met. It happens. Ashley's I think it's because she buys her glasses at like thrift stores and dollar stores. Well, that's because I'm tired of getting four or $500 pairs of glasses and losing them. And then what? And then you know I'm what? out. I have two pairs of glasses. One I have had for about five years and the other I've had yeah, for well, that's about a year and a half. good for you, but I just <laughs> lose things. Ashley Sweden, how much did that one go for? So 55. $55. Wow, Tasha, you're, you do really good. I'm just walking away today. 55 for two amber rings. Very nice. Very nice buy, Ashley. Now I want you to I want Tasha to tell you a little bit about this ring here. But I'm going to tell you a little bit further about it, okay? Don't look at my nails. <laughs> um This is a very special ring. I looked this one up a long time ago. This looks very much like one that I picked up uh recently and brought to auction just last week with the way it opens up. Um from what the research I could find um much it's kind of almost like a clotter ring it's it's two hands holding the heart um and the research that i could find on these rings this ring here in this particular shape and form look how nice the detail is on those hands the ones that some of the ones that i could find were not detailed like this this is a much better much much better well-made yeah ring and it's really cool so i'm gonna let tasha tell you a little bit about where this came from and that kind of thing no i don't remember where this came from i know that we got it some like i don't know if it was a thrift store or yard no, sale I, yeah i bought it at a yard sale actually oh no i bought this at a um it's only open one day out of the week from like 12 to 2 30 and it's part of a church and it's just a little uh, thing and the woman told me about it and i came home and i did research on it anyways this particular one here was selling close to i think it was like 75 dollars. It, it's an amazing amazing ring and i had given it to um i mila tasha's ex-wife really liked this and so i had given it to mila and Mila wore this, but then she wore it as a symbol of their love together. And when they split up, she gave it back to me because she didn't want to wear it anymore. And I understood that. Um, again, I got rid of all my jewelry that my husband had given me. Um, and, and we're still great with Mila. As a matter of fact, Mila just tattooed uh, Tasha and Marissa the other day. And that's just a special ring. It's a neat ring. And it's one I won't wear. Um, I just won't wear it. So it's been sitting in my collection. It's it's just a sweet, sweet ring. Let's see what size it is. Dollar three, baby. Ashley, ever look at your glasses? Find the spare, put them on, and <laughs> click against the ones you had on. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. I I don't necessarily kind of like a clara. Yeah. Don't necessarily try to put on another pair of glasses and find that out, but sometimes I'll be looking for my glasses and I have to like slap my face to see if they're on my face, especially <laughs> when I'm at work. Yeah, I do that quite often. It very much looks like a clotta. That's why I mentioned that in the beginning, because that's what it reminds me of, um, which was a symbol of a marriage thing. I think that was like in Ireland. I have a whole thing on the clotta. I have a I have a clotta pendant and it's got a whole little thing that tells you all about where it started and when and and how it just stuck. So this one's Irish, yeah. Right about six and a half. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. But, oh, oh. But, yeah, here, let's see. Does it fit my size seven finger? 
It does very nicely. It sits. Yeah, I know Gina's got small fingers, Gina. It's a, it fits my seven great. Neat ring. What What do you want to start this one out, Tasha? Oh, <sighs> well, I think just based off of what you said and uh -huh. how much you got for yeah. it and all that good stuff, like I'm gonna have to start this one out at a little bit more. I would probably start this one out at forty five dollars. Ooh, dang! Is that is that is that that's too much? Well, I wasn't <laughs> gonna start there. How about? How about we start it at 30? 30. Okay. okay. That was uh, my original until okay. you started saying yeah, how much well, you paid I mean, for it. I think I it can nervous. go. It can go see, for a lot more. But see, I think starting is... bid of 30 is fair. And if anyone is really... Gina's in at 30. Yeah, it's it's an amazing ring. And uh, good luck finding another one. And finding another Honestly. one that's made that well. I've never seen a ring like this. I can't remember what the research that I did. I cannot remember who designed it or anything. I don't think that there's any markings in there. You can check. Open it up and look inside. We're looking for a bit of 32, guys. It's very unique. Under the hands or in the hands. Dang, maybe we, maybe we should have started at 45. <laughs> It That's okay. It does say it? something. Yeah, I remember looking that up when I got that. That was long, long time ago because, um, yeah. It says B A E K 925? B A E K 925. I think. I think. 32. We got 35. Let me see. Or B A 5K? Here, let me see. Oh, it's Basque. B-A-S-K-925. It's Basque. Okay, Basque. So it was... Um, huh? It was my ex-husband and I wore in white gold. Really? That's cool. Hey, Star. Star, okay. just a heads up. We are looking for $2 increases. But right now we're at 36 Okay, so I guess we're looking for 38 on the two hands. Reminds me, yeah, of the clotta, but also just how nicely those hands are done. Reminds me of the ring that my mom had made for me. Just, Have you shown them that just one? Just clutching the little, yeah, I wore that one recently. Of course it wasn't gold, Kirsten. That's just really neat. It is. Really, really cool. So we're looking for 38. A gimmel ring. Thank you, Kirsten. Yeah, it's been a long time since I looked this up. But are you going to find if you look at look at a lot of them that are um are available and they they're just not made this well. 40 Gina Gay. Here you go, Tasha with the pretty hands. Miss Gina Gay is in at 40 bucks. Tasha, what you got going there? All right, we got $40. We're looking for $42. Very unique ring, guys. I don't think I've ever I've never seen anything like this, and I've obviously seen a lot of jewelry. <laughs> We got 44 to Pandora. Looking for a bit of 46. I found a ring like that in 10 karat gold. It's double ring and the hands open and close. It's Hi, size. I can't hear you guys on the phone bidding blind. <laughs> To make the fingers so beautifully. I know what they did a really, yeah, really good job on that. Yeah. Okay, let's see. The size of um, ink on her hands. So the size on this one is just about six and a half. But as my mom said, it does fit her size seven fingers. So it's a Very little well. bit big on the six and a half. But yeah. that's where it sits on the mandrel. Not in the mood to bid against my friends. Aw. Well, that's... Very sweet of you, Gina. Also makes me feel bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, Pandora, we got you in at $44. Looking for $46. Stars out. 
All right, we got $44 going once. $44 going twice. So this awesome Gimmel ring, as we just learned it's called. Hi, Miss Kirsten Red. Thank you so much. And if you and guys have not checked out Kirsten's channel, um, please go check her out. And Miss Gina Gay. They both have amazing channels. And there may be a few other people in the house with channels. If you guys want to link your... Uh, your stuff down here in the chat, you're more than welcome to. I don't know if I have to type it in, but you guys are more than... Here, as a matter of fact, I can make... Uh, okay, I'm going to make you a moderator, Gina. And I'm going to make you a moderator, Kirsten. Because you guys got channels. You guys um, are now modded. Mo you're modded. <laughs> uh, so if you guys want to leave your... Uh, your link you can you can put your link right there in my chat for everyone else to uh check out all right it looks like star came back in with that 46 and now pandora's back up to 48 so we're looking for a bit of 50 dollars and we call oh. it the gimmel ring stars out for real this time so we got 48 going once 48 going twice and sold to sold. Pandora Furnace for $48. Congratulations! Kirsten's moving on up. <laughs> <laughs> Basque is French and Spanish, right? Uh, I'm, um, yes. I, I often wonder, because I'm from England, I have green eyes and uh, kind of reddish hair, which is very, um, very Basque. Um, and so I wonder down the line if I'm not, uh, from that region somewhere in my bloodline. What is that one? And it's a ring, Gimmel ring. It was for yeah. whom? For Pandora. Pandora for $48. Thank you, Pandora. <laughs> Tasha does so much better than uh, me at this. <laughs> Tasha's hired. Well. I don't necessarily think that's true because you have a lot more information on the jewelry than I do. But you're learning. So that's why we're I like. Team. I really enjoy watching you pick up something and the way you describe it and how much you do know because you pay attention. That's a good girl right there. Let's just do these because these didn't get sold not so long ago. Well, they technically almost did. And then somebody yeah, they just, do, they just never did the follow through. through. So we're going to just bring those back real quick. They're Onyx, Tosco. An awesome pair of earrings. Sterling silver domes with post earrings or with the post. You're awesome. Can you link your stuff in my in my chat, or do I need to do that? Were you able to ship out my ring? Absolutely, it's you. in the mail. I shipped out two packages today. Uh, yours, I put a rush on it. I put a uh, special Priority. delivery for you. Yeah. Priority mail. Priority mail, and I asked for um, ex expedited shipping for you. So you should have that anytime. And I do have my uh, tracking on that for you if you need that. They do look like black and silver beach balls for sure yeah they yeah i put them together and yeah and fun these are gonna be about five eighths in diameter together the weight of these two lovely earrings oh no thank you hello strangers is gonna be 15.4 grams hey link curdy hi they remind so, me of Crusades with that cross. I think that would be like 7.7 7 grams yeah. each oh. of weight. And on the sure. back, what does it say? It's, it's their Tosco. It says T dash, um, TS dash 105 Mexico 925. And we did test these the last time. They can oh, be yeah. tested again. I wish I had both my phones. Oh, wait. That doesn't... <laughs> that was... Hey, Lois. I was wondering what holes we were talking about. Yeah, well, you know, it's funny how um, YouTube decides to block that because you're talking about a hole. They just automatically think you're 
being obscene or something. I noticed there's a few, like, I'll get a notification that I got a message, and then I go to get the message, and it says this message is no longer available. And I'm wondering, did someone leave me a really crappy thing, and they just took it off? Or I don't know what that's all about. I, I feel like that's what that is. All right. So what do you say if and we start... One of my halls got infected and it closed up. Oh, bummer. That oh. used to happen to me a lot when I was younger. That's why I can only wear glass or stone in my ears. Anything That's else. Weird. I'm being so good bad. tonight. <laughs> what do you say we start the bidding out on these at $25? You got it, Tasha. That's what you say. Okay, Tasha says a starting bid of 25 Okay, let's see what happens. We've got the lovely I think they're Tosco. Very they are different. They are different. Very nice. Black and silver beach balls. I mean, who doesn't want that? Get them right up there. Get them in that camera. Let them see those beauties. There's an ointment for that, Linda. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I I like to use coconut oil and tea tree oil. It yeah. seems to always help my ears. As a matter of fact, that tea tree oil thing, I mean, I sliced my finger really good yesterday right here in that crevice. I mean, it was sliced almost down to the bone, you guys. It was sliced deep. I put a little bit of tea tree oil on the Band-Aid. I kept the Band-Aid on overnight, and I swear to you, it's healed. There's no... It, it's just my skin's back together. I love me some tea tree oil for everything. Like any skin irritation or problem, I go straight for the tea tree oil. It looks like we have no interest yeah, we're, in we're these just guys. getting rid of those, Tasha. Put them aside. Get them out of All there. Right. Going once, going twice, and sold. sold. Back to our jewelry box. Ding, All right. Ding. How about these lovelies? What does this say what right here? This? These are sterling silver earrings. Oh. These got a lot going on. Right down the side here, it says... Why don't um, you do this one, and I'll be right back. All right. Huh. I don't know what that says. Whore? H-O-R? <laughs> That's what I just read. H-O-R. Whore? Har? Har? Whore? What does it say? I'm, I'm not trying to say bad words or call anyone names here. It's <laughs> what I'm reading. It looks like H O. Oh, wait a minute. You know what? These ones, I think, say the same thing. Is it H-O-B? It is H-O-B 925 Mexico. H-O-B. I've never looked them up, guys. Never looked them up. But I have two pairs. H-O-B 925 Mexico. Clearly marked. Beautiful marks on both. And these are... Whoosh. These are both long and dangly. And then I have these ones that are, they're like the same exact thing, marked exactly the same, just there. HOB925 Mexico. And let's just check this out. Let me go down. Let me go down. This is one pair. Oh, just smooth like butter right there. These are actually very weighty compared to this one here. And again, it just goes on smooth like butter, this pair. Yeah, got the 18K. They both lit up blue. Testing sir, sterling silver. Um, maybe is should I dip these and clean them real quick so you guys could really see how pretty they are? Company that makes bangles in the 1990s, real silver. Awesome. Is that these here? The um, HOB? That's. Very cool. Well, they, they make earrings too, I think. Um, I don't know where things are. Okay, here we go. Here's the scale. I'll just put them on the scale for you because that's what Batosh has been doing. And she sure seems to be like a pretty good salesperson. 
Yes, I Googled the mark. Thank you. No, I appreciate that. If I had access to it right now, I'd probably do the same thing because I'm I love to learn. I think that's awesome. HOB is something a uh, company that um they made through the 1990s. So all right, these come in at 5.4 grams of sterling silver. They are a total length of oh two and a quarter inch for the drop with the whole earring. They're gonna hang at three inches length from your ear hole. They are going to dangle three inches. Just like so. Dingle, dingle, dingle. Dingle. What do we start these at, Tasha? We have two pairs. We can just do them separate because they're almost identical. Only difference is this is built-in ear wire to the post or to the rest of it. And these are separate, um, but definitely with the sterling ear wire. What do you say? Um, what do you say ones? there, dear? Why don't we start these ones out at $20? Whoa. What? Okay. <laughs> Tasha she says needs to quit bucks. asking me. I know. Well, we'll see. They're either in or they're out. It's twenty dollars, guys, for the lovely H O B. Oh, Hob nine two five Mexico sterling silver three inch drop earrings with the uh, what is that thing called? The bar. 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 It's a bar. I always feel like these are kind of like weights. Sharon Bolt said yes. I really like them at 20 looking for 22 what's that i don't know why did you say whoa i did i yeah whoa <laughs> i don't know i guess i wasn't expecting anyone to come in <laughs> but sharon loves them so i i don't blame you we can definitely clean those so i think they'd look stunning with the ear wire all cleaned up all right, looks like we're going once to Sharon Bolt for $20 if we have no other takers at 22. Going twice to Diana Bolt. Sharon Bolt. Uh, oh, Sharon, Diana, and look, I'm getting, <laughs> this is what I do at night, guys. We all get our names mixed up. We got a couple of barbs now. We got a couple of uh, Two people with the last name Rocks, R-O-C-K-S. You know, it's like it can get real confusing. <laughs> As a few of you probably already know, getting emails for someone that wasn't you and yeah. It's it, all of us. Yeah. <laughs> Diana said, uh-huh. Yeah, I probably got one of those too. <laughs> oh, see, that's why you said Diana. Well, yeah. Oh, Bolt, Bolt and, Bolt. and Bolt. See? You guys, it can be very tricky, especially when it's one thing when you have a new friend like Dee Miller who's been here for a little while, and then all of a sudden you start getting new people in, and and then they there's several people with the same name, and it, it can get really just. We all three have had a hard time with that. Sharon's out. Looks like Dee Miller's in at 26. Looking for 28. Mold broke and all that. <laughs> all right, I think yeah, you're the only Linda we have right now. Going once. No, I think that's going twice. Huh. D. Miller must have amazing. She certainly, I know she does because I, I, I'm in other places watching her purchasing some things. And we are sold <laughs> to Miss D. Miller. Okay, Tasha, we got one more pair here. They're probably half the size as the others or so, where'd that pen go so you're saying you tell me well if you weigh if you weigh them compared to those we got d miller 26 um let's see bar earrings congratulations d yes thank you d oh oh <laughs> All right, those are from Miss Lovely D. We're going to just call you Auntie D. Auntie D. That's Tasha's new auntie. She's my sister. <laughs> I think Lois is my sister, too. 
All right. What we got going here? Thanks, Lisa, <laughs> Tanya, and Sasha. <laughs> D, when I see you bidding, I'm like, I'm out. out right? Yeah, I've seen her. She's, when she likes something, she got to have it. So these so ones just, are all one solid piece, as opposed to the other ones where they dangle. That's it's kind of that, cool. Okay, dangle. This was one of the words the guy used in a, in a term, in a technical term, for the computer when I was shopping. He brought up the word dongle, and I was like... I just about lost that. it. What the heck is a dongle? I go, dude, I've already told you. I don't know these techie terms. And what the heck is a dongle? I just about lost my cookies and I had to leave. Honestly, a dongle. In I a wanted computer. to pretend like I didn't know her. Unfortunately, I walked up to the guy with her, so <laughs> couldn't walk away and pretend. It was uh, something. It really I don't was. Wanna, yeah, a dongle, I don't want to know either. I don't want to know what's going on. I don't on know what a dongle is, but I didn't freak out when he said the word dongle. But he's trying to explain <laughs> it to me. I, and, I, well, I know. And I'm like going, Are you, I was lost 10 minutes ago, and you're still throwing these words at me, and now there's a dongle involved? <laughs> not a dingle, not a dangle, but a dongle. I was like, oh, my God, I'm over it. I, I had uh, a panic attack. I shame. ran to the car and cried. I literally she ran to the car. Did. And then. And, and then from Best Buy, we went over to go and get curry, and she had another panic attack because she thought she had lost her card. I'm serious. I did. I thought I lost my card and left it there. No. Who had it? Tasha had I, well, it. Well, I did. Tasha had it, and she was ready to jump in the car with me to go back to get my dongle back, <laughs> to get my car back, no, card back. Yeah. Okay. That happened. Okay. <laughs> Enough. So... As mom said, these ones are much lighter than the other ones. So I think for that back, I'm going to start them out at half of the price as the other one. So All why right. not start these ones out at $10? All right. Oh, wait a minute. You went 30 on the other ones. No, I went 20 oh, Okay, $10. We're going to do a starting bid on these ones at $10. Same company. Same company. Ashley Sterling Silver. In at $10. Did you test those? Did you test them? We can definitely test Let's them. Let's test them. I love just, testing. I just like to... Um, Where'd yeah. you put the stone? There it is. It's right there. Um, I just want, I just don't ever want right. to send out anything ever again because I know there's so many fakes out there. Ooh, we're going to test I from the stem. for next. And we're also going to do a little test from the, the bar. So that's the stem and that's the bar. Oh, wait. Hubby overheard. A dongle is a USB stick containing software license key. Thank you. Thank you. Now, if he may have said some stuff like that, I may have been able to understand that. Next time we go by a computer, can we borrow the hubby? Yeah, right? I hate an entire bag of fake stuff. Oh, my gosh. I'm sorry, Ashley. Lit up. What? I she hate. said, I hate an entire bag of fake sterling. So she probably ordered something and got it and it was all fake. I'm assuming. Wow. Yeah. I, I just don't want to take that risk ever again. I just, I felt very uncomfortable when the woman reached out to me and says, just the silver chain was silver and the pendant wasn't. And the only way I can resolve an issue like that is just send it back to me. I'll refund your money. I, from Shop Goodwill. Oh, that sucks, Ashley. Wow. Uh, yeah, just send me back the product. I'll send you back your money and the shipping costs that you had to cover. But yeah, moving forward, I figure it's right here. And I enjoy testing. And she enjoys testing. Just don't get it on you. Yeah, my skin will just turn yellow for a couple of days. Wow, how's how dishonest yeah well you know what it was probably a bag full of stuff that said 925 china 925 thailand uh, and yet is magnetic and is not and they have a machine they know they know what they're doing they have a machine that tests all that metal it, it, you just shoot it right to the metal it'll tell you exactly what alloys are in there and they probably threw it all in a bag and just were dishonest because they're it's a corporation they're all about big money not not helping people out, you know? All right. Yeah, they sure do know. Of course they know. So if, right. they, if they know it's gold and they know it's 18 karat gold, they sure do. I mean, I've heard they've got a gun. They, they test that stuff like that, whatever that thing's called. All right, back to the earrings. So right now we got Ashley Sweden in at $10. We are looking for a bit of $12. 
for these lovely sterling silver dangle earrings. Yes, yeah, stick with your small local thrifts. That's what I say, yeah. You know, I did this. I shopped the heck out of those Shop Goodwill boxes every Friday for a long time. And and the thread up boxes, I'm just over it now. I tried to get one a few weeks ago, and by the time I got in there to pay for it, it was already sold out. Was, I was mad. It was like this is ridiculous, and I don't need it anyways. We have gotten lucky going on once. Things. Yeah, the one I got from Tasha for Christmas. She got me a um, the um, what's the one that comes out every Friday? The Goodwill Blue Box mm -hmm. um, that you gave me for Christmas. There was a. There was a David Yerman 18 karat gold and sterling silver bracelet. Um, it's amazing. It's about an $800 piece. I still have it in my collection, but it was in there. She got it for me for $34. Yeah. They didn't see that one. I did. This is the first thing I found in there. So, for $10. Congratulations, Ashley. Oh, wait, Topaz. Oh, wait. Oh, that was Topaz Gem. 11, not 10. Okay, Ashley Sweden got those for 10. Hi, honey. Hi, what time do you change? You never changed the time. I forgot to change the time, but it had to have been around when we got home, about 12. Yeah. 12.30-ish. 12.30-ish. She ate. I don't know that she ate a whole bunch because she was... Uh... Okay, Ashley... Sweden. Sorry. My son wanted to know when I last fed the kitty. Ten dollars. Um, silver yeah. earrings. Dee does not want her earrings cleaned. Oh, okay. You got it. I, I, I don't like cleaning silver, quite honestly, just because I'd rather you guys do it. A lot of people like that look. What? Mm -hmm. Getting dinner ready. What are you making? Yeah. I'm hungry. All right. What else do we have, Natasha? You want to sell this? Do I ever? Just do it. Oh, look at in this. Oh my gosh! Someone left. What is this? Ooh, That's this Tiffany is and Tiffany. Cow. Yeah, I showed you guys this the other day. This came out of the bag of jewelry that my friend brought over the other day, and I told you I find a lot of Tiffany in here. Uh, and if you zoom in on that and get up there real close with no distractions, you see how perfect. It, are you seeing that real good, Marissa, over there on your screen? Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's just sitting in there just perfect. When it's fakes, there's always just a, it's something's always a little bit off. Uh, with these types of things. One of the things you look for, like Miss Makeup Zombie had mentioned the other day, is the um, the hoops, uh, and you see that they are soldered shut. Where everything comes together, it is soldered closed. And if you look at the cartouche there, it's just perfect. The word, the lettering. Are we seeing this? He says hi, Marissa. Can you guys see that? All right, I'm going to let Tasha get back to that one. Maybe if you threw a couple of vegan sausages in there, I, I'd be down. <laughs> they, they make those. They're pretty good. And I have not looked this one up, guys. I just got it like two days ago, three days ago, something like that. I haven't even looked it up. But I know what Tiffany sells for and what it goes for. And I know this little elephant that I've got chilling right over here. Where did he go? Where did my little elephant guy go? This one here. This one little charm right here is on eBay for in the $300 range. So where do you want so to start that one, with Tasha? that, I'm going to go ahead and let you start the bidding on this one. <laughs> um, I don't want to say the wrong number. Okay, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do a starting bid. Whoops. S B. I'm going to do a starting bid of $50 on this Tiffany & Co. Beautiful double heart pendant. Um, is your phone available? We could look it up real quick with the... Um, let's see what it goes for. All right. What's happening in the chat? 
They are from an Amish farmer's market in Pennsylvania. Mm. Do you live in Pennsylvania? What's the weather like? All right, we got 50 to Lisa F. I'm looking it up real quick. It's cold. I have a friend. She's a travel nurse and she's in Pennsylvania a lot and she's here a lot. Um, but I, her home base is in Pennsylvania. And every time she goes home for the winter and takes pictures, oh my gosh, okay. it looks so beautiful. Here's the one on the Tiffany & Co. website, guys. Excuse me. This is Tiffany & Co.'s website. That's the pink one, and it's selling for $210. Uh, where did it go? Oh, $225. I'm sorry. There's there's the price there. $225. Right now, we're at Lisa F. for $50, looking for $55. Looks like we're going once to Lisa F. for $50. Nobody likes the Tiffany and Co. What? Turn it around. Show them what's on the other sides. What does it say there? This is engraved on this one. It says 2017. I don't know what I the didn't. significance is of that. And what does it say on the other one? On the back? Nothing. Nothing. I didn't even know it said anything back yeah. there. All right. Looks like we're going twice to Lisa F. for $50. Looking for 55. Lisa, you got yourself a good deal, it looks like. And we are sold for $50. Ooh. Let's see. Lisa F. Tiffany. Uh, $50. Very nice. Very good. Very good. Enjoy, Lisa. Thank you so much. Thank you. And what's next? Let's do this guy. He's cute. Shoes. Do that one, Tasha. Mm -hmm. He is cute. Very cute. They seem to like stones. Is it true? You like stones? Stones. Oh, I almost fell over. They like Brighton, too. Sometimes when I hear like the temperatures that other people are experiencing and we're over here right. like talking about how cold it is and it's in like the 60s, 70s. Well, it's because it gets so hot when we're out and then the, the temperature changes like overnight. But then overnight. like even the heat here is going to be so much different than yeah. in the East Coast. Like the East Coast, it's just going to be like a lot more humid, whereas it's very dry here. Like 110 here is so much different than 110 there. Right. Well, and especially if you go down north or down south or up north, it, it gets different too with the temperatures. Well, of course, up north, it's a little colder. <laughs> this is a really cute little Buddha. Is this Jade? It sure does look like Jade to me. Yes, ma'am. That's Jade. <laughs> Jade necklace. This is a little charm on this gorgeous chain. This one came out of my closet. This is a personal collection. As low here in Tennessee tonight is 37. Wow. Yeah, I, w I think when I got up this morning, it was like 4 o'clock in the morning. It was like 42, and then it dropped just a little bit. Ooh, yeah. It just, it was it nice. It got cold It was six. cold, yeah. And then also it dropped right around 6 o'clock, even a little bit colder. It was so cold. Well, there was a wind, too. A little bit of a wind and that chill factor. Just, yeah, to the bone. But that's what I'm saying, because I'm sure that they've experienced weather where it's like 10 degrees. Cute little Buddha. Imagine. Yeah, or even negative. Cute. What are we starting this one out, Tasha? Whew. Well, this one, I, I mean, I yeah. really like this charm on here. So I think because of that, I would at least maybe, maybe 
25. Oh, I'm like, I'm sweating over here. It, okay. it makes me really nervous now, I to like come I shouldn't up with the put price. put the pressure on her because she has no clue how to price things. And right. I mean, I'm just, I'm just going. I'm, we got like, a little bit of $25. It's, it's on a sterling silver chain and it's very cute. The, the chain says 925 Italy. We can definitely test things if you would like. I like testing. No pressure, no pressure mom. mom. Right? Yeah, I, I don't. don't I haven't I been putting any pressure on these kids lately. That's uh, that's why we're all so happy around here. <laughs> no, I, it was a little bit too much pressure, and maybe I shouldn't put that much pressure. How about we Testing do that? that chain. Um, chain. How about we change it, Tasha? Okay, I'm. I'm Is that down. okay? See? How about we do a starting bid of ten dollars, guys? Just to um, oh, we had topaz jam in at twenty five. Oh Look my at what you gosh! Just done, done, and done it. We can come back at ten dollars, topaz. I'm fine with that. <laughs> twenty seven, Pandora says. All right, we're just sticking with it, guys. Sticking with it. Twenty seven dollars right. to Pandora. It lit up. A length, Tasha. A length. The length. We didn't Let's even we, we didn't got. even measure the uh, Tiffany. Oh, so this one's gonna be eighteen inches. Eighteen inches long. Yeah. Looking for twenty nine. For the little Buddha. 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 Ooh, what's that? What is that? That's cool, whatever that is. Oh, interesting. Interesting. I like it. I like big butts. Oh, did you hear her? She said, I like big butts and I cannot lie. You and other brothers can't, can't deny. deny. When the girl walks in with the itty bitty waist and a round thing in your face, you get sprung. One Baby got it going up. on. Or no, did I get the words wrong? I don't know. I lost it at some point. Tanya, could you put it against your dark shirt? Absolutely. Yes. Woo! We can do this too. Hi, Jane. Hi, Jane. How are you? He is really cute. He really is beautiful. Yeah, on both I love sides. I like that. He's, he's got a nice design on both sides of him. Just a happy, jolly man. Just a happy, <coughs> happy guy. Oh, well, just a happy, 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 happy guy. guy. 29. Oh, nice. Thank you. Let's see. We got Topaz Jam 11 in at 29. We are looking for 31. What's going on next here, folks? Oh, yeah. I remember this one is just stuck. That sucks. What is going on again with the tickle in the throat? Where is my water? The thing's broken off to push it, to pull it out. To push it, to pull it out. Looks like we're going once to Topaz Jam 11 or 20. No, we had Pandora come back in at 31. 31. You guys like jade? I've got a lot of jade. I've got a lot of little jade things. Not that I want to discourage you from this guy because he's just awfully cute. Awfully cute. Is this a mixtape? <laughs> right? <laughs> it could be. Topaz is out. Pandora is in at $31 going once, going twice, and we are... It's been a good day. 
got a parcel in the mail that included a boulder opal ring from moon goddess treasures very nice i love boulder old opal it is so beautiful with the flashy colors and the little brown matrix it's an it's amazing jane good for you love to see a picture of that boulder opal is amazing oh, i guess it i guess all of it doesn't have the brown matrix i'm sure but uh there's a guy here that cuts boulder opal for a living in what he deals with yeah there's a lot of brown matrix it's very beautiful we have who is this 31 pandora congratulations uh, 31 pandora for the buddha 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 better does it feel like better it looked like better all right oh how's my phone i better plug this sucker in did you guys see this one oh luscious not today just a tease <laughs> you had to come back and play another day for that one just a tease that might be one of those catch and release ones pandora all right what else they tasha we have some great items and i cannot wait to get my first parcel from Tanya. Oh, well, I have, well, actually, Jane, we've already sent you one, so you should be getting one anytime, but, um, this, uh, yes, your first parcel, you should be having that anytime. Um, I don't know how long it takes to get there to Canada, but I do have tracking information. You're gonna I saw know. that opal you got. It, it's gorgeous. Oh, you did see it. I wish I'd like to see it. You want to do that one? All right. But I think you know more information about this one, so I want you to do it. I don't know a lot of information about but this you know other than... Them? Okay, here's what I do know. What I do know is this is Siam Silver. And um, Siam is, I believe, that's what they used to... It's now been renamed... Can we look this up real quick? Yeah. Siam had was renamed in some year and is now called oh what this is vintage and i just think that that is made from something else because why would you put something burma thank you jane it was on the tip of my tongue okay so it was re so siam is uh is what they used to call it so this would date in thailand yeah i was thinking thailand um yeah it's right there it's right there um myanmar myanmar anyhow so it's it's older Okay, this, they don't, Siam doesn't exist anymore, basically. It's, um, oh my God, we're bad at geography. Yeah, we're, I mean, who cares about this kind of stuff, right? <laughs> we just like the jewelry. Um, so I believe that this right here was actually a part of something else at a different time. I'm suspecting only because... I mean, I have another ring, actually. I do have another ring that has something on the inside just like this, but whatever, it, right, whatever it is, it's gorgeous. It's absolutely stunning, and it's old, and it's just amazing. I think it's very cool that the person that's on there, it's different you, on both sides. Yes, I've heard it. I've heard it. Um, I, I like to watch a lot of those documentaries, too. As a matter of fact, Lois was talking about the Amber Room last night in over in a chat with... Uh, Oh, gosh. I think it may have been Makeup Zombies channel yesterday afternoon. But look at that detail on the side there. How beautiful is that? That reminds me of um, the henna that they do on the hands mm -hmm. um, in India. The way that that's done there. Beautiful, beautiful ring. It's gorgeous. What are we starting this one out, Tasha? Oh, this, oh, this is a much larger size because that's my size 8 finger, which means over here I've got an 8.5 still a little loose there and just ever so slightly loose there so i'm i'm guessing eight and a half nine nine it's a size nine 
Male, yeah, male and female forms. Absolutely, yeah. I could tell on the uh, inside she looks very feminine. Um, very feminine and not so feminine here. It's big. It's a size nine. It's uh, what are we starting it at, Tasha? Toshiba. Um. Oh, do you, do you hear that shake in my voice? I know. Well, I don't know because of all the like little fancy things that you said about her. Like she could be a little bit more. Um, maybe twenty five dollars. All right, starting bit of twenty five dollars. Vintage. Does it turn? No, that would be. Super I know. Cool. That's what I thought it did too. No, it's that's why I think it's a piece of jewelry that someone made after the fact because. Yeah, it's interesting. It does kind of. Don't force it. No, I don't know. I'm not doing anything of the sort. It almost looks like it's just kind of twerked in there. We have Hello Strangers. Yeah, whatever. It's it's an amazing ring. It's old. It's vintage. It's very, very, very ornate. lovely and ornate. Look at that detail on the sides. You got the pretty hands there, my love. You do it. Did anyone else lock up? What? Did we get locked up? What happened? What does that mean? I don't know. They better not come lock me up in my house, I tell you. And put a lock on the outside of my door where I can't get out. I'll get real mad if they start doing some crazy stuff like that. I don't think that's what, I don't think that's what she <laughs> I means. don't think that's what she meant either. <laughs> oh, I was just teasing. I have been, I've seen a pair like that. The thunder and lightning sky beams. Yes. Yes. Pretty awesome, right? Yeah, I have, um, isn't that interesting? Yeah, I, I, I love all that kind of, I'm looking behind me because I have some, yeah, I have a few things sitting around like that. Just, you know, this right. kind of thing. We got Kathy Almond in at 27. Yes, and how there was a great war in the sky. Pandora in at 29. Nice. Tasha does so much better than me at this stuff. <laughs> You're hired. We're looking for a bit of 31. Crazy Maystache. It's a goddess, but I forgot her name. The one on the front of this ring? On the inside. Or on the inside. I think so. Oh, look at this. Here, put the camera up. Look at that. Hand carved. Lovely. Mmm. Kathy Amon is out. And now we're at 29 to Pandora Furnace. She's got lots of cool little things around the house like that. She's always collected things like that. All right. Maybe to represent duality. Hmm. All right, we got twenty nine dollars going once. We're looking for a bit of thirty one dollars. All right, we got thirty one to Nicola Morgan. Woo woo! Oh ow! Oh. Hello, Strangers is out. Right now we are at 31. We are looking for a bid of 33. Pandora's coming back with that 33. We're looking for a bid of 35. It fits very, very comfortably. Well. Ring feels pretty solid, but like not too heavy. I can see how much it weighs. Mm -hmm. This ring says it comes in at 7.8 grams. So we got 33 looking for a bit of 35. 35 to Nicola Morgan. We're looking for a bit of 37. Do we have Nicola's? Niela? 
Nieya is her name. Is that that's the goddess's name? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Well, that's very cool. Thank you for the information. Perfect. We have Pandora in at thirty-seven. Currently looking for a bit of thirty-nine. Yeah, you want to go outside? You want to go outside? Come on. Cola is countering back at that with thirty-nine. Looking for a bit of 41. All right, Pandora, we got you in at 41. We're looking for a bit of 43. I like the one on the inside a lot. I like her pose. And it's upside down, so when you flip them, you can see them like that, which is kind of cool, rather than just spinning it. What's that? Oh, you just spin it? All right, Nicola, we got you in at 43. We are currently looking for a bit of 45. I have another ring that I, I want to find real quick because that's a cool ring. Pandora, we got you in at 45. Mom just said she's going to go look for another cool ring. I don't know which one she's talking about. That's kind of exciting. All right, Nicola, we got you countered back at 47. Looking for a bit of 49. Pandora's back with that 49. Hi, Christina. All right, Nicola is in at 51. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to be looking for that $5 increments from here. Oh, Pandora's out to Nicola. Sorry, there's a fire truck going by right now. Goddess name is Nicola and is the goddess of lightning and the god of... Ramason, God of Thunder. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you for the information. It is a very nice ring. Very pretty. And right now it looks like we got Nicole and Morgan going once for $51. Aha! I found a secret stash. So the goddess is the one on the inside, right? So this one is Mikala. We got 51 going twice. Looking for a bit of $56. Hi, Christina. Look. All right. And we are sold to Nicola Morgan for $51. Nicola, I don't know if you've ordered from us before. She's in. We got we're, you. We're told you are in. Congratulations, Nicola. Okay, this one. You can do this one next. Wait, I didn't I didn't do a bell. Oh, ding, 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 ding. ding. Thank you. You'll enjoy that ring. Tasha, you can do this ring next. Oh, that one is cool. Yeah. Again with the look what's underneath there. That's on the inside. It's got a lotus flower. And whatever that symbol is there, it's on an adjustable band. And looky there. And if you see here, this is natural stone. And that um, matrix, that's the matrix that you're seeing there. The, the swirls, the striations here. That's the natural stone. I believe this is onyx. That's a pretty nice ring. What's happening tonight, guys? Please let me know. I'll, I'll be over. <laughs> I'll see you tonight. What's where, happening tonight? Yeah, where, where are we going? Where are we going? going? What's who's got the thing going on tonight? I don't know. I haven't been on YouTube for a few days now because we've just been busy. Isn't this a neat ring? Okay, you can do this one nice. Or nice. Nice. <laughs> yes, you can do this one next, Tasha. <laughs> you know what I mean. Oh, there's awesome. some cute rings in here. Oh, my gosh. This is my other thumb ring that I used to wear. Money bags. It's got three bags of money. I'm going to put that one back on. <laughs> no, I won't wear that one. I did wear it for a long time on my thumb, though. Just this. It's got little dollar signs on the front. What's happening tonight? I'd like to know, too. I really would like to know. 
We're going to have to test that one. I'm not sure yeah. that that's silver. That has been in my collection for some time. All right, let's test it. Let's just test where it. where this camera is. Ready? So I'm going to scratch the back. And maybe the back is a signature of the artist, perhaps. Absolutely, very much could be. Yes. I, I agree with you there that, yeah, because it doesn't look like a normal symbol. I mean, I have a lot of, uh, I have a lot of symbol type, type things in my house that are very Asian inspired and they're usually, you know, for health, um, wealth, uh, love. It's not it. Okay. This is costume guys. Okay. Tasha just showed it. It's scratched copper. So it's just silver plated. I had a suspicion it was, but I didn't care either way because it's just an incredible ring and I like that it doesn't sit this is how it sits on your finger so to look at it you'd have to bring it towards yourself or to show it you'd have to show it this way either way I don't care it's awesome and this is scratched into the stone it's like scrimshaw it's it's like scrimshaw in there so it's carved into the stone there you can see the I never saw the back of a ring like that. I know, me neither. This was the first one I'd ever seen like that. But I love the lotus flower. And the lotus flower opening on top like that, uh, when you see the bubbles coming out, it represents enlightenment. Enlightenment. So and yeah, that probably is a signature there. What would you like to start this? Costume silver. It's just costume. costume. But it's a very lovely piece of jewelry. This is natural stone. I, I'm assuming that's onyx with the way that matrix is in there. And what are we starting it huh. at? So much pressure. Oh, um, stone might be uh, rytate. Rytate? Rytate. Hmm. I don't know. Never heard of that. Where's the rotate. book? Rotate. Rotate. Uh, rotate. Oh, I think she's saying if you Oh, rotate it may rotate. Oh no, it, it does not rotate. No. It's that's it's just the way it was the... made. That's that's what I thought was so undifferent and unusual about it because it doesn't quite make sense to me. I mean, maybe it was something else at one point and it someone just made it into a I ring. Mean, it makes sense when you're showing someone like that. Yeah. Like, I mean that's awesome. It Either makes it easy. I think it's cool. What are we starting it at? Well, I think I guess being that this one is not actually silver, I keep wanting to use this keypad. Could probably start this one at maybe ten dollars. Okay, we're gonna start it at ten bucks. Tasha said, "That's cool." It's just it's a nice it's piece beautiful. of stone. It's beautiful. Sasha is getting used to being putting on the spot about pricing. I mean, am I? Yeah. That is the most nerve wracking thing. Well, I don't I feel like mind. I'm gonna get grounded if no, I sold something. No, you're not gonna cheap. get grounded. No. <laughs> <laughs> Costume yeah, can be no, awesome. and it's Never... probably, I'm sure it's nicely plated, you know, I don't think you're going to have, um, missed the size. So actually this one is adjustable. It is adjustable and uh, but... Tasha has large fingers and that was on her middle. Thanks. Well, I'm not saying that in a bad way. I'm just saying she's a large girl compared to me. She sits at size eight and a half. She's much taller than I and built. She's like built. And she does CrossFit. Let's get this right, people. I'm not saying my daughter is a big girl. She's a big girl. She's, um, you don't want to mess with her, let me tell you. <laughs> We're in at 14 with Pandora. I'm also super nice, though, so. Yeah, but, I mean, yeah, she's never really, I'm well, not, I'm not like but she's mean. never been in a physical altercation. Well, I mean, it was a something I had to do at one point in my life. Yes, to protect someone else. And we'll just leave it at that. And, yeah, that she's a strong girl. <laughs> 14, looking for 16. Gosh, for the, your friend, thank you so much. She is out to Pandora. So it looks like we've got Pandora going once for 14. Anyone else want to come in at 16? Got this awesome ring. I'm gonna get rid of this keyboard, keypad thing, because I keep wanting to use it. Bear. There's Come on, sticker. We got 14 going twice to Pandora. Hey, where are you at? There. Come on, get in there. And sold. 
to Thank Pandora you. for $14. Woo! Congratulations! I don't know why I feel the need to like dance that every time somebody wins, but I always feel like I, I gotta, gotta dance it out. Woo woo! Woo woo! Woo woo! Dance it out! Dance it out! Dance it out! <laughs> Congratulations, Pandora! You know, last night it was it was so funny. We got back. We had to run over to. We went to Walmart. Uh, I hate Walmart, but we went there to get some. Um, Shipping, not shipping supplies, but office supplies. Some things that we needed to get a little bit more organized. And so Tasha and I went into the store. As soon as we walked in the store, we're both, you know, it's cold. We both have like sweatshirts on. I think I had a hoodie on. I think I looked like a cone head too because I had a bun on top of my head. And we both had masks on. And we walk in and it was playing some Christmas song. Tasha immediately walks in the door and starts singing and dancing. I walk in right after her and I'm singing and dancing. We're just both singing and dancing. Like, it's just yeah. what you gotta do. It's what you gotta do. I, I wish the world was a musical. Like, right? That would that be would awesome. Be so Ooh, that's a neat ring. It's like a bird's nest ring. Oh, you know what? I made a bird's nest ring. Where is it? It's not in this this one. Um here, you want to sell one of these? You want to sell... Here, how about you sell a whole bunch of these? A whole, whole bunch? What, what, do you, what do you mean? Oh, what's that? That's neat. That says love. That actually looks like 14 karat white gold. Love, love, love. This is money bags? Yeah, that's cute. You could... I mean, if you want to do some of these smaller rings, just do like a whole little bundle thing. You know, like that. Putting me on the spot. Don't it don't feel pressure. This is just All right. stuff. Who we're, cares? We're just gonna do stuff. It's just stuff. I think that one looks kind of cool. Just like these are just small thin rings. No big deals. Small little tiddly winks. Yeah. There was a time where I would just wear these, you know. I just put on like a whole bunch of these that all are the same, just like on every finger, and it just looked cool. I don't know. I liked it. I liked that look. I like it. I, I love, love it. it. I want some more of it. All right. Well, we got these four rings here. Ooh, that one's neat. Thanks, Nicola. We got this one too. Oh, sorry. We have five rings. She threw another one in. Let's separate them all. We've got this nice little rope knot style ring. Yeah. It, it looks like a rope to me, so yeah. I'm, I'm going to go with the rope. This one, I, I feel like it just looks really fun in like the middle that part of my ring. It's kind of Celtic almost. Celtic design, maybe. I don't know. It's hard to see on that camera. Oh, no. Just some cutouts. There you go. Cutouts. Okay. That one's really sweet with a little tiny stone. Little black stone in there. Black stone? <laughs> this one has... It looks like two snake heads, but it's not. But like two snake heads coming together. Yeah, I'm not exactly certain. It's just little wires. And then this one is just a little... It's got a little dot design. Do a scratch test on all of them. We're going to scratch them. I like How many is them. that? Five rings? There's five rings. And we're going to start them at five bucks. How about that? Dollar each. Starting bid at five dollars for five sterling silver rings. I'm going to test them all right now. Kathy's in at five bucks. Got one. Butter. I felt it. I, oh, that I felt that one too. That butter. Really butter, good. butter. I can hear it on the stone. Ashley, we're looking for seven. That one didn't sound She's so questionable. hot. That did not. Say, well, it's copper. already here. Here, we'll put that one in instead. We'll get rid of this one. This one came on copper. We got we Kathy like Allman. Copper. Yeah, co the copper's out. That's butter. So we're gonna go ahead and replace that with a copper one with this one braided. right here. That's braided. That looks like a braid. Go up. It close. does look like a braid closer yeah much so much very much so like a braid back it up back it up what's focusing no yeah well anyways we're in at 17 uh, all right. just scratch that um, one scratch this one all right and just do one drop and run it down the whole line 
The middle one, you can see very clearly. It's not even middle. You can see which one was the copper ring there. Yeah, we're, we're not going to worry about that one because it's over here now. And the rest of them are ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. Silver, so all of those $19. Very Ashley looking for $21. For five sterling silver rings right here. They're sweet. The They're small. They're cute. Um, and a, Who is that one? Well, you should have put them in a row. I did. I I'm sure it's fine. You can scratch a little harder if there's, you want. There's one of them I, I am questioning a little bit. So I'm gonna... Well, do them in a row so you know. it. Hmm. Maybe that one. If any, we don't. We want to make sure they're all silver what? here, folks. Keep them all in a row so you know that one is one. Two. That's two. That's three. Three. That's four. Four. Are they all small? I'm going to give you sizes all... right now. Five. This make one sure is a size seven and a half. This one is a size six. This one is an eight and a half. They're all They're all enough. silver. They're all light enough. I think I just didn't silver. scratch the other one hard enough before. There you go. This one is a size seven. And this is the only one that's small. And, ooh, that is small. That won't fit on that pinky, but it fits this one very nicely. Uh, so that's probably a five. So we have Kathy in. Actually, this is showing a four, but it's not sitting on the mandrel proper. So, I think it's more of a five because my finger's the size. Kathy Allman, once for $21, looking for 23 Kathy Allman, twice. I like wearing these rings like at the tips like that. I, I do that too. I'd put them all on like that, and then I'd wear these other ones right at the tips like, like this. Like, it just, the midi ring, you know. Going right. twice to Kathy. And we are sold for $21. Congratulations, Kathy. Yes, thank you very much. Congratulations. Would you like to sell this, my dear, while I do this for you? Because you are such a big Disney fan, and... That's really cute. Really, I'm just a big kid. You I... know, when she was a kid, she always told me she wanted to move to Never Never Land. She did not want to, uh, yeah, she didn't want to <laughs> live here. She wanted to be, she wanted to move to Never Never Land. She in, did not want to grow up. In my head, I will always be that child. Most people find it very hard to believe when they find out how old I am. Yeah, even looks or the way she carries herself and the way she dresses. She's very young. She's always hung out with younger people. And I, on the other hand, always hung out with older people. So this is a very, very sweet little tiny Mickey Mouse charm. He is sterling tiny. silver, according to the little marking on his back. But of course, I will test that. Yes, and the, the tag itself. Um, where's the other one? Do you have the other one? Oh, no, it's all there. Yeah, Let me have the say. bag. Bag. Why don't you put that over here? Let me have that. Thank you. All right. So the little tag on here, it says Disney 925. So that's actually Disney silver. <laughs> Probably Cute. sold right there at Disneyland. I'd exactly. Imagine. I am only as old as I let on. Therefore, I am a spring chicken. Yes, me too. I tell you what, I don't feel any different than I, excuse me, than I did when I was like 21. I still feel exactly the same. I, just, I still feel like I'm in high school. So like, I'm, honestly, just, and when I just, the only time I feel different is when I look in the mirror and I'm like, wow, my hair is white now and I have wrinkles. That's weird because I still feel like I'm that same person. Hey Mickey, hey Mickey. <laughs> you're, you're so, so fine. You're so hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey, you're so fine. And you're so fine, you blow my mind. Ooh. Yeah, that's blowing. Ding, up ding, right ding, there. ding, ding. 
So blue. All right. Oh, wait. We didn't put... We didn't... Wait a minute. Where did that go? What happened? I thought I just wrote... Oh, it's in there. Jeez. Look at me go. You see, you see how she Where's just starts freaking out going? like that? In this bag. Like oh, we've been doing. You've been, you've been making all the sales. Shoot, I keep walking away because I just like feel like I don't even need to be here. I'm going to test Mickey's little foot just to double check that part. <laughs> just because. All right. We never know. Foot. We well, never know. And they might have. They might have put a shoe. Yeah, they, they could have. They could have put a, a non-silver. Well, you shoe didn't on show it. them all the way, but it did light up. It did. What's the starting bet on your little Mickey necklace? After fifty, I finally know who I am. Right. That's the only difference. I wish I had the body and the face of myself when I was twenty-one, with the knowledge I have now. That'd be great. I felt my best when I turned thirty. I, I, this is my best year. My 40 sucked. All right. So, <laughs> I think for this sweet little tiny Mickey Mouse chain. We all chain, do, Tanya. Yeah, right? Maybe Good. we'll start this one out at $15. All right. We're going to do a starting bid of the little Mickey. Starting bid of 15 Tasha wants to do this. Starting bid at $15 for the... He's just a very sweet sterling silver Mickey Mouse Disney. If you have any grandkids that are really into a great little Christmas gift or something, $15 for Disney Mickey Mouse sterling silver pendant. Finding out stuff about me. <laughs> Tasha is right there with you, and she's, yes, she's figuring herself out too. Uh, well, am I? Well, she's we're still, learning. We're she's learning. learning. Yeah, I got I got everything figured out now, except for how to match whose name with what email and what YouTube name. That's the only thing I can't figure out in life. It's just it's something. It's a man. puzzle. It is a puzzle. <laughs> it, it it's like those little games in the books where you have to draw the lines to match. Like yeah, who is who? Like oh, and then for some reason, like I get Pandora and. Um, I get Pandora and who is it? Topaz. Oh. I get those two mixed up all the time. But I'm getting to know you, like Jane Litterick. I mean, I see your picture, Jane. I love your style, love your hair, and your name is Jane, and your email name is Jane, and I know who you are. It's easy. But then we've got Hello Strangers, and it's like, okay, what's Hello? I still can't remember what Hello Strangers' real name is. I'll get it eventually. I mean, it's going to take time. Hello, you don't act your that... age? Good, Jane. I think you and I would be good friends. <laughs> Is that one Karina? Karina. No, it's not oh, Karina. So oh, it, it, that part's oh. a little um, like Timeless Jewels by Deborah. We know she's Deborah. Christina is Christina. Pandora is Pandora. Who's my jewelry addiction? You're one of those confusing ones. Well, just saying. Linda's in at 15. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah. All right, we're looking for seventeen dollars. <laughs> I surprise myself some light sometimes. Like, okay, okay, I see me. I see my mom now when I look in the mirror. That scares the crap out of me. I tell you. I see your dad. You when I look in the mirror, you see my dad. When I look in the mirror, I see Papa. Uh, you know what? I was looking at um something. There's a picture of me. I was looking at the other day, and I was like, oh my god, I look just like my mom. I mean, my dad. It's my dad. My eyes, like my eyes, look just like his. Yeah, my aunt Lorraine tells me the same thing. Your my name, is, name Mia. is Mia. Oh, your name is Mia Crazy May Stash. All right. Do you have a YouTube channel? Hello, strangers. Because you got a good Marty. name. Marisol. Marisol. That's right. All right. That's right. Yeah, it it gets a little. It gets a little confusing, guys, but the more I see you, the more I know who you are. You're working on it. Awesome. Well, let me know when you get one. I'll, I'd love to come subscribe and give you shouts if anyone else is in here in this chat tonight that, that has Shout. a uh, channel. You're more than welcome to put your link in here. All right. We're going once to Linda Cook for $15. Looking for $17. Going twice. For fifteen dollars to Linda Cook, looking for seventeen. Marisol means ocean and the sun. 
Oh, very nice. I like that. Yeah, my cousin is married to a Marisol. Yes, very mm. nice. A what? And, uh, Marisol. There we go. <laughs> so, to Linda Cook for $15. Thank you, Linda. <laughs> Tasha's laughing at me? You, or are you just laughing? No, I was just looking to see if Marissa reacted to how you said that name. Oh, Marisol. <laughs> Ma Marisol. 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 Uh, $15. Mickey. She's trying. Yeah, I, Mickey. <laughs> I always welcome the new viewers of jewelry communities for each other. Yes. It's, now you took the bags. It's awesome. Oh, I did take the bags that time, didn't I? I have an IG account under my name and shows off some of my wacky artwork really Ooh, well we're gonna right look now. for you and you're an artist too i love jane i just know that you and i would be friends i'm sure of it um shall we do another little bundle of these rings and these are just gonna be like various sizes of the same almost exact rings what you think shall we you do you boo boo Oh my gosh, so cute. I'm looking for Jane really quick. Oh, she's seen a tattoo. <gasps> wow, that was some really neat artwork right there, Tasha. Um, I don't even know why I came in here, but I do know that this is very sweet. And what does it say? We'll just do this. Uh, hmm. Do this say anything? They certainly do. Here. Here's a loop. Here's a loop. That's a nice ring. It says inspire. Uh-huh. This one is hard to read. Part-time artist. I still work for a living. Oh, very nice, Jane. Yeah, I... I um I did that for a long time. I wish I could get well, I will get back into my art. I need to get crafty. I'm always crafty. I'm always okay. doing something. I know this one says inspire. This one says trust. I don't know what this one says. Maybe laugh. I think it says laugh. A laugh. L uh, yeah, L A U G H. Absolutely. Okay, and it looks like it's silver, but we need to test that. We're going to do this ring yeah. right here. Um uh, I'm going to just do a starting bid. Um, let's see, starting bid of uh, $15 on this ring. It's beautiful. Uh, we're going to do this ring. I aspire to do more on return, but yes, always crafty. Right? I mean, I'm always fiddling with something, but to sit down and actually just do a piece of art, create a piece of art, it's been a while. All right, so I just scratched that one. We're going to go ahead and... What did you scratch? Because that came up copper. You don't even have to test that. Was that just the pendant? Yeah. Okay, that was part of the pendant. Because the chain totally looks silver. Um, oh, this one's signed in here. Well, it's got like a little 925, and then there's a cartouche next to it with a... It's just a little circle with something inside of it. Do you have a platform, Jane? Where do you show your work? Um, I think she just said she was on Instagram under the same name. So, Tasha. So, this oh. chain is definitely silver. The charm, on the other hand, is not silver. Oh, bummer. Oh, yeah, this one's going on like better right here. And it is lighting up blue. Both of them. My mark is over here. I didn't put a big scratch in it, I could put a deeper scratch. Are we. Well, I was just, while you were still showing that, I just thought I did a starting bit of $15 on this ring and it does not fit that finger. So I'm going to say this is somewhere around a size six and it is sitting on the mandrel just at a size six. It's very cute. Oh gosh, that we got to get that up. I found Jane. You found Jane? Mm -hmm. Let's follow her. <laughs> following oh darn of social media oh you don't i i don't really do social media either that's a really pretty ring we have a starting bid of 15 dollars on that one 
I love that everyone is um, artsy. Hi, Patsy. $15. Oh, how cute. I love your little kitty work, the kitty cats. How That's neat. Cool oh, my gosh, Jane. Ugh. It reminds me of stuff like, um, like what uh, Cynthia and... Oh, Jane, you're my best friend. I want to hang out with you. Look at you. You rock. I love the little blue stripe in your hair right there. All right. Oh, the size is a size six. It's a size six. Looking for $15. By Tisha Moore, I have to admit. Okay. I don't know who Tisha is, but we're going to check her out. It's a very nice ring. It's done really nicely on the inside, guys. Nice and smooth. Very buttery finish. All right, we're going to move on. What do we got, Tasha? You better get them a real mm -hmm. ring that they want. You better pick one out. You like better pick one. one out. No, not out of here. Get one out of the good box. Shoot, girl. Right here. The good box. Yeah, let's show them the good stuff. We'll get rid of this little piddly stuff. This is a neat ring, though. That's got gold on the sides, and that is a neat-looking whatever it is. Meteorite, hematite. I don't know what that is. It's not hematite. I don't know what that is. So you're saying you want to do this one? Well, you may as well get that one out of the way, and then find you a really nice ring in here. You could do that one with these and just call it a bundle. How about that? She really wants you guys to have these rings. Well, I, I, they're just in here, and they're just, I mean, <laughs> one of these little things taking up a whole spot in a slot in my ring section is not cool. All right. These ones are both very small. Oh, well, actually, all of these are very small. Let's see. Let's test the size. This one's really cool. I don't know what type of stone it is. She said maybe meteorite or... Hematite. I don't or... know. What, you're not. Look at look at what you're doing. All right, let's get in there better, so they can really see what's happening there. It's got to focus. Through the ring. Yeah, it's a stone. I mean, it's it's stone. It's cold. And then it's got the. It has like a matte finish on the stone. Yeah, it's not polished real nice. And that's the way it's supposed to be. And then it's got these little, uh, it's Black like Hills gold. Black Hills gold, which with, which is 10 karat gold uh, panels on either side of the band itself, which is an eight, no, a six. Almost a six. Well, I think it fits here, though. That's a size seven. Size seven. It fits my seven finger. It was just a little rough coming over the knuckle, but it feels more secure. Um, what's going on on the inside? The inside. It's very vintage. It, it looks very old. It really does. I don't actually see any markings in here. No? Maybe whatever that is, but it just looks like a... Like a little, like a little round circle. dot circle. Yeah. Oh, I found something. You Let's found see it. what it she says. She found it. It says Sterling S P C O. So it is signed Sterling, which leads me to believe very much vintage. It looks vintage. It's a vintage setting, and then it's got the Black Hills gold. I mean, yeah, that's that's vintage. Probably like seventies. So we're also going to throw these four rings in here. They're all sterling silver, I believe. I mean, I will definitely test all of them. This one says 925 right inside of it. This one also... Yeah, these are all ones that can't, that I used to wear. I'm sure they're silver. This one I'd question. But, oh, it just went on like butter. This one says 925. Let's... Let's just do a testing. It's just fun. I enjoy it. All right. This is number one. That's number right. two. Okay. One, two. 
That's three. That's four. And we'll go ahead and just do this one. And that's five. And all of them went on really, really well. Oh my gosh, that's loud. Watch your finger. All right, and you can see everybody is lighting up nice and blue, so all of them are going to be sterling. What is your starting bid, well, Natasha? I would say because we threw that little guy in there. I don't want to breathe that. Oh, put it out. <laughs> put it out. <laughs> Why don't we start this one out at $20? All right, we're going to do a starting bid of $20, and um, yeah, I'm not sure what that is, guys, but I mean, it's... It's got a really neat look to it. And it's, that's the way it was because I don't think it would have been wore down. I mean, if it was just wear, it would just be worn just on top. It's worn all the way around. So it was polished to leave that type of finish, almost like a matte finish on there. It's a really cool piece. All right, we're we got 24, 24 looking for- Nicola Morgan. Yeah, no, here you go. You looking for 26. Get Let me five stretch and see what lovely the rings. Dogs are. You got thirty dollars to Rachel Davis. Bears right there. She knows this is a good deal. Thirty-two to NS. What do we got in my pocket? A dollar bill, y'all. What's that? Dollar dollar bill, y'all. Whoa, whoa! How are you guys we doing? Got Thirty-four doing? to Nicola Morgan. Uh, what time did we get here? 38 <laughs> to NS. You just let me know when you need to, uh, when you guys are done. Because okay. I could do this all day long. We got $40 to Nicola Morgan. We're looking for a bit of $42. These are all very nice rings. This one is really cool. It's like, it's just circular all the way around. It doesn't get flat on the inside. I like that. It's a little it different than nice the others. Too. Pretty thick. You got forty dollars. We're looking for a bit of forty-two dollars. This one does have that nice Black Hills gold on the sides. All right, we got forty-two to NS, Nicola countered that with a 44 now we're looking for a 46 and this is out at 44 Nicole and Morgan we got you at 44 we're looking for a 46 got Nicole and Morgan going once for 44 dollars Nicola Morgan going twice for $44. And sold for $44 to Nicola Morgan. Congratulations. Oh, oh. Look at her go. Just look at her. I mean, look at her. Oh, did I show you guys this yet? Oh, teaser. Smoking How about we give deal. away it a is. prize? It really was a smoking deal. Let's give away a prize, Tasha. Trivia question. Trivia question. You come up with it, and I'll find the prize. Well. Oh, we're out of the little... Tiny bags. Let me grab some. Yeah. All right. I'm going to give you something easy because it was said earlier in this no. video. What? Not, not that one. Save that one for another day. See, she tells me to okay. pick something. Then do both. <laughs> okay, go ahead. No, it's okay. So no. You pick your question. No. I'm sorry. I should just keep my mouth shut. 
Tasha, you call it. No, there, we're, we're going to do that one another day. No, we're not. Yeah, we are. No, we're not. <laughs> Fine. Okay, you do it. <laughs> what is my mom's favorite color combo? Good question. My favorite color combo in the comment section. Nicola Morgan. Yeah. Anybody? Trivia? No? Pandora, no? Close. Orange, blue, topaz, gem, turquoise, pink, pink, blue. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, topaz, it was, it's actually orange and turquoise together. Coral and turquoise. Jane got it perfect on the nose. But I think that we've got a couple of winners here. So we're going to go, um, orange, blue, topaz, gem got it. Linda Cook, we'll call that pink and blue. Yeah, it's close enough. And turquoise and pink, Diana Bolsh. Uh, and it's actually, uh, orange and turquoise together. So Jane Litterick. Yes. So we've got, uh, you got them all. Okay. Oh, okay. I can write it down. Orange is my favorite color. Absolutely. Orange is my favorite yes. color. Okay. So we're just going to put a bunch of you. We're going to just throw these in your bags, guys, with your stuff. You're getting an extra prize. Jane, L, and, okay, we got Diana. We got Topaz. We have Topaz. And, is that it? Yeah, it's everybody. Oh, Lisa F. Okay. Yeah, I already had Lisa F down here. We got you. I'm completely out of the. Oh, stop okay. it, Jane. Open I just shop with, with all my press. Friends. You should. <laughs> Seriously. I mean, honestly, just watching you guys, I was like, oh, shoot, I could do this. Everyone else is doing it. Okay, you guys all get a prize. That's going in our goodie bag. Um, I'm going to hook you guys up with some stuff. Let's do another trivia question, Tasha. And for this one, we're only getting one prize, and it's going to be a special prize. We're going to give away these sterling silver earrings. All right. What will the question be? <gasps> What's my son's name? Ooh, that's a challenging one. What's my son's name? And if anybody spells it right, I think they should get a bonus. Yeah. If you spell it right, you get a bonus. <laughs> Boy. Oh, my goodness. Oh, you're very welcome, Topaz. Hello, stranger says I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Linda Cook Boy. I don't remember the name. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I do mention him often. Um, I think I've only mentioned his name, though, maybe twice or three Trey. times. I like Trey. Trey. That's cute. And I think I said, um, son, <laughs> don't remember you calling him by name. Oh, I do call him honey. Um, okay, let's come up with a different one then. His name's Dylan, guys. D-I-L-L-E-N. Yes, Dylan. You mention your son often, yeah. Yes. I, I just, I, I don't really call him by name, though, but I have mentioned uh, his name. I, I'm sure of it. Um, okay, let's do a different question, Tasha. I let's see. Something about Grandma. Why something? Or, okay. Or something about my dad. Maybe what? Part of England. What part of England am I from? Both me and my mother. North. North Spain. <laughs> York. York. Yes, Kathy. You got it. You got this lovely pair of 14 karat gold earrings. 
very nice. York Yorkshire. Actually, you guys, if you've never seen York Yorkshire, you could look it up. It's, I mean, it, I pronounce it York because that's how I've always been told to say it. Um, there is a wall. It's a Roman wall from like 300 BC that sits all the way around the city and you can walk around the whole city and all the buildings that are standing inside of the wall, mostly Roman um, from the early BC era. Um, I mean, of course, there's a lot of new structure and stuff, but most of the large uh, castles and you know, big buildings. There's a place called the Shambles. It's all cobblestone roads. And the buildings are so close together at the top that you and your neighbor could like share a drink together, you know, across the way. And as other everyone's walking underneath, it's pretty neat. Yorkshire. Really? That's cool, Pandora. Maybe, um, maybe my grandparents knew your grandparents. That's neat. Great, great grandparents. Oh, great, great grandparents. Oh, yeah. My, uh, my, my parent, my mom's side, um, my mom's side of the family, they've been, uh, I mean, that's, oh, here's the ring I was talking about that I actually made. I made this in a wire wrapping class at the uh, Gem and Mineral Society. I made a whole bunch of these and I used to sell them. It's like a little robin's egg nest with the little pearls in there. Isn't that sweet? Yeah, they teach wire wrapping there and that's that's one I made. I used to I used to sell the heck out of these at the um art hop and stuff. Cute. Let's give this one away too to one of my lovely subscribers. Let's do one more trivia. One more. One more. How many brothers do you have? How many brothers do I have? Fingers ready. How many brothers do I have? Two. Two, six, three. three. Diana Bolsh is absolutely correct. And Jane. Yes. I have a half brother from my father. I did grow up with two brothers, but I have mentioned my uh, stepbrother. So Diana Bolsh. 17? Yeah. That's uh, maybe my dad has 17 um, children that I don't know about because he has been maybe married my seven dad times. Has 17 children. Yeah. I don't Natasha's know about. dad. Tasha's dad definitely has 17 kids. Oh my gosh, that guy. Okay, this goes to um, Diana. And then Jane, we're going to give Jane this here. Jane gets this one. That one's pretty. Yeah, it looks like a little jade ring. That goes to Jane. Okay. My ex's aunt has 19 children. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Yeah. She's probably married to my daughter's father. <laughs> oh my gosh. I hope you like that, Jane. Uh, let's see. What size finger? Well, I think you guys, it'd probably fit on one of your pinkies if nothing else. All right. What are we selling? We're just giving stuff away. Let's give away another prize. <laughs> Oh, that's sweet. Let's give this away. Let's just, <laughs> seriously, why not? It's just sterling silver. It's little tiny hearts. It's so sweet because I love you guys. Yes, pinkies are just fine. And that's where I would wear a ring like that because otherwise I'd be apt to smash it on something and break it. So on your pinky, I think you're a little lighter with your hands. She must be exhausted. I mean, to have 19 <laughs> kids, that's like yeah. for 20 years straight. One wow. after another. That's insane. One of 11. My mother was one of nine. Uh, one was a lost, long, long lost brother that they just found recently, like in the last, uh, oh gosh, I think the last 10 years. Um, so we're going to give one more ring away. This ring here. And it is for the first person to answer what question? Hmm. Uh, what did my dad, why was my dad in England when he met my mom? Why was my dad over in England when he, went, when he met my mom? I think I just mentioned it yesterday for those of you who were paying attention. Military is correct. Which branch? Ugh. 
Army's not it. Air Force, Jane Litterick. You get it. Ding, 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 ding. Jane pays attention. I'm just going to add this in here. Okay, Jane. Okay, yeah, she's just going to put it in there. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Jane. Um, and, you know, Kathy and Linda, they're both very close, so why not? We're giving them prizes, too, because... <laughs> Because I just have to. But thank you, You get guys. a prize. You get a prize. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Everyone gets a prize today. <laughs> Tell your friends. Give them stuff out over Kathy. here. Kathy. <laughs> <laughs> Free something. Okay. Let's just put that in a bag. You can please send that to Nicola. You're so sweet, Jane. Who's Nicola? Is she in here? Oh, Nicola Morgan, are you serious? Jane, you are so sweet. That goes, that, Jane wants that ring to go to Nicola. You're, you guys are just such wonderful people here. I love Which you guys one? so much. The one she just won, the little silver ring. You are so sweet. Gosh, you guys just never cease to amaze me. I mean, the amount of love you guys have for each other and support you guys just you guys just are awesome people you guys are just amazing people and that's why i don't mind giving things away let's give something else away <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. what we got over here tasha all right let's sell something <laughs> way to go ladies you guys are just so sweet all right shall we do an earring bundle Let's do an earring bundle, Tasha. Oh, let's do these earrings, guys. Is it okay. time for those? I think it might be time for okay. these. I just picked these up today. I have not even got to savor them. Tasha's like over here having a, another panic attack. No. What? I just I just wasn't sure. We just got those. Well, we got them for what? To just sit here on this all day? Or I'm back. What did I miss? Oh, you just missed a lot of trivia, Lots Lois. Of free stuff. Yeah, we just gave it's, a, a, a whole Oprah bunch of stuff here. away. Yeah, it's Oprah. We're doing the Oprah Winfrey show. All the things I love. Jewelry, jewelry, jewelry. In the service. Yes, uh, he was in the Air Force. So, these are lovely. These are turquoise, as we can all see. They are set in sterling silver, and I just picked these up today. They're just slices. They're quite lovely. That was the other one, right? Huh? Diana. Yeah, Diana and... Jane. It was Diana, Jane, and there was one other who said... Um, hmm... Diana, Jean, and then there was an army. Um, like that. Kathy, yeah, Kathy Ullman. So make sure Kathy gets an extra prize in her package. Okay, so we're gonna go back to these. Sorry guys, beautiful. Yeah, these are stunning. So what I think they did here, because as I'm feeling these, if, if this was a whole slice of turquoise, actual stone, that's a large chunk. That would be super heavy. This is a very thin slice that has been inlaid in here on either side. And I'm sure there's something like, um, they use in between, like to set a stone, you'd put uh, like cork underneath there or something. So that way, if it gets slammed, the stone's not gonna break. They sometimes use, I've seen them use sawdust with, uh, I don't know, different things. I found different things under stones when they come out. Uh, and I'm assuming that's how these were put together because, again, if this was a solid slice of turquoise just slabbed in there with wrapped in silver, it would be super heavy, and I don't th know that you could wear that comfortably. These are lovely. They are gorgeous. I just got them today from my gold guy. Those are nice, Tanya. Yeah, they are absolutely stunning. Stunning, and I don't even know why I'm not going to wear these and enjoy them for a minute before I sell them. I just saw them in the case. Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard that too. Oh, they're just fireworks. oh, they're fireworks. It sounded like a gun, you guys. Someone's lighting off a firework out there. Jeez, I hate that. 
Um, catch and release. Yeah, I caught them today, and I'm going to re release them before I even put them in my ears because I just know I'm going to fall in love. And then I'm going to end up wanting to take off my jade, and I'm just going to wear this for a long time. I'm going to wear this piece of jewelry for a long time and share the stuff that I have. What? What does that mean? Mm -hmm. Yes, of course. Always. Yeah. If that's what you mean. Okay. Too much just giving me sign language. <laughs> um, what are we starting these at, Tasha? Oh, man. Don't. That's too much pressure with those. I don't I think so. I wouldn't know where to start. Well, I tell you where I want to start. I mean, I I would want to start these at 50, but I'm not going to go there. You guys can go there. I'm going to start these like this. I'm going to do this. Starting bed of $30, you guys. And I'll let you guys duke it out. $30. Hello, strangers. These are absolutely stunning. Yes. Looking for 32. Look at that stone. You can see you can see that matrix in there. Just not polished right through topaz gem 11. These are actually very 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 pretty. This is something I would wear all day. I really like these. We have $34 going to Star. We're looking for 36. Yeah, look at that color. Oh, They're very nice. Oh my God, I wish I wouldn't have put them up against my face because I might want to bid on them. <laughs> no, I don't buy jewelry for myself anymore. I just don't. I, I have enough of it. I have a couple of my, my faves. We're at thirty-four dollars for star. Looking for. Oh, we're in at thirty-six for topaz gem. Beautiful. Let's see a star coming back at 38. I lost the fight. <laughs> it's okay. It happens. Is that right? All right. We got Topaz Gem. Ah, we got Star in at 38. She's liking that. Here you show. <laughs> I have to find those emojis, LOL. Those are just so pretty. They're gorgeous. They're absolutely gorgeous. Topaz is out. All right, out, she says. So we got Star in at 38. Well, now we got Jane back in at 40. Jane, those would look amazing on you. You know, Thelma said earlier how she needs to stop wearing silver so much unless it's a really large hoop because they kind of get lost in the silver hair. I get that. I feel the same thing. That's why I do like wearing stuff like this because it really shines. And they will look stunning on you, my friend, especially if you had that little... That little turquoise streak in your hair still, that little blue streak. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Kathy, Going... I don't have so many crystals. My mom definitely has more than me. Would you like um, some crystals? Let's see. Tanya not... and Tasha, do you ladies collect crystals? I do. I'm asking because there are some awesome crystals out there that help you so much with stress and anxiety. Yes. Yes. Then... I have my little... Um, I have my little crystal shrine right over here. I don't have any crystals. I do. I do have lots of crystals. And yeah. I wouldn't know which ones would help with stress and anxiety. I, I used to have, I would make a whole grid and everything. Yeah. I've yeah. got some thank pretty Thank you, Kathy. That is cool. very sweet. Yes. Thank you so much. And we do cleanse our house with um, sage. We, um, out to star, enjoy. Oh, Jane. Well, all right. Star, $42 going once. Anybody else want to come back in at 42 Beautiful pair of yeah, turquoise Yeah, they're ears. stunning. I mean, I could see these going for 60 and that's okay. 
You are welcome. Yes, thank you, Kathy. I love how you're so into your crystals like that. It's been a long time since I was, I, I really got into my crystals that I do so love them very much. I, I wish I knew more. You about know what crystals, I did? Honestly. I, um, at one point when I, I talked to you guys about how I really got into a meditating and stuff and I got into it so hard that I felt like I was going to, that I almost left this place. I got into it so hard that I, it scared me. I was I, worried I about then, it for a long time. Yes. I then, um, I, I had a real frightening experience. Oh, whoa. What was that? Was that another power surge? I didn't see anything Anyways, happen. I, I kind of got scared. Yeah, <laughs> and we're sold. Like we're sold to... Well, what's happening? Star. No one else came in. Star, you got him at $42. Um, Congratulations. But it, yes, thank you. And I ended up burying so many crystals around my house in the ground that you guys don't even know about. You I guys, didn't know that. Yeah, I got rid of all my crystals. Um, I had whole eggs... Um, that you know they open up and i never cracked them because i didn't want to and i just buried them around the house not just those but um yeah i buried there someone's gonna have fun one day and they're gonna find a whole treasure trove of yeah so i have a crystal i pretty much have a crystal grid around my house good night jane thank you for coming i think she says she might be back okay all right so we are at star X O X O at forty two dollars for the Turk earrings. Turk, Turk earrings. All right, and we'll put those in the bag. Put it in the bag. That is not. All right, I don't know why this is over here. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Let's do a boom, ring. Boom, 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 boom. I want you in my room. Let's do this one. That's, That's so boring. pretty. I really like this because it's just, it seems very, um, I like that. It feels good. It's like one of my rings. It just fits real nice. Very fluid, very um, organic, very flowy. Are you tired? Um, we, we might shut I this down. I have been up since 3.30 this oh, morning. Oh, you so. did go to work. You tell me. I don't know even know what time we came in here, Tasha. What time did we get in here and start this? I don't know either. Oh, it looks like the tree of life. Look at that. Okay, here's the stem. It starts right there. Okay, it's a tree. So there's the stem. I love figuring jewelry out. There's the stem. And if you follow it around, the tree trunk goes up. Well, here. Okay, there's the stem. And if you follow it, it turns into the tree. That's awesome. I like that a lot. Shoot. Do I want to part with that? <laughs> I want to see the tree. I hate when I find something like that. Yeah. yeah. Well, it fits my size seven finger. I see. You see? It's yeah. a tree. It's like the tree of life. And that That's makes cool. it it makes it all the better. I just like it a lot now. Gosh darn me. Keep that one, Tony. No, I can't. I got enough. Girl, I can't keep any more jewelry. Are you kidding me? This is um, NF925. NF. Whoever NF is. Enough. Enough. NF. Someone's going to tell us. I know. Is. Someone's going to look it up real quick. Tasha's going to look it up. It sits on the mandrel at a size 6, but it fits my size 7 finger. So, um, what should we start this one out? Tasha... She was with um, me. She helped me pick out a lot of these. So she was with me today when we went shopping at my buddy's store. I, I mean, I think it's a really nice piece. It's, it's a very beautiful ornate. piece. It has very whimsical oh, swirls. Yeah. Very probably whimsy. probably started at 25. 25 is a great starting bed. So we have a starting bed at 25. What did you say, Marissa? Um, praise me, May said almost three hours, lady. Three hours? <gasps> Are you serious? It seems like we just got here. I I've been here for an hour. I was I to know. Check. I honestly, I don't have a clue what time we got here. I, I wasn't paying attention. She, and it was kind of nice because we didn't plan it. We just like, when we were ready, we just said, okay, let's do it. So we didn't have to think about it. We just dove right in and here we are. She works us to the bones, guys. Oh my gosh! Slave I pay driver. I pay them handsomely. Trust me. 
slave driver. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, right. It's lighting up blue. Lisa is in at $25. Looking for $27. Tasha, show this lovely ring off on your finger. Ba, 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 ba. I don't, what size is this ring? Is it well, going to fit my lovely finger? Nighty thing? night, Pandora. Oh, good night, Pandora. Oh, we'll good see night, you. Pandora. Um, we'll see you again soon. Uh, we're going to do all the shipping out tomorrow, guys, on these, um, all the lots. Anyone that has a smaller bundle that hasn't purchased a whole bunch of stuff, we'll sound out a little, you know, if it's just one item, it's going to be like $5 for a padded envelope shipping. Um, if it's a small amount under 12 ounces, um, or 13 ounces, it can go in the flat rate, uh, box. Yeah. Anyways, we're going to do shipping tomorrow. I don't know. 25? We got Lisa at 25 looking for 27. I might have to bid on that one. We can we can do this one the last thing if you guys want to. You guys are good. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm cool with that. Are you guys cool with that? It sucks. We'll be I'm back, back soon. ladies. I had to run and check on my hubby. You heard a crash and he didn't answer. Oh, no. oh yeah, that can. He hurt his booty. Oh <laughs> well. <laughs> oh booty booty hurts are not it's nice not. ones at all all right looks like we have penned jane we have this new lovely ring and it is as we've just noticed it's a tree so it's got the branch Did you kiss it better <laughs> we got 27 for mj yeah it, it's got the tree branch or the trunk that just comes up in a swirl there and then it joins onto the tree so it's like the tree of life he kisses your booty. Kisses my booty. Oh, he kisses that. your booty. <laughs> yeah. Uh, my booty. Linda Cook smiles. We got Lisa in it. Uh, she says, I really like it. Yeah. $29. $29. Oh, I hate booty bruises. Right? Booty bruises. You know what? It's I. A my brothers, I've, I've mentioned this in one of my early videos. My brothers used to call me bruiser. My dad used to call me Tank, and, uh, yeah. Like, she wants to talk about being tough as a kid and being strong and all that stuff. She, she was the scary one. I've heard stories. <laughs> I've heard some stories. Someone was telling me that their daughter was, like, um, in school, they like to arm wrestle men and take them out. Yeah, the, I was one of those girls. <laughs> she was more than that. She, I, I remember a story when she was Mrs. in elementary T. school <laughs> and my uncle Lee, he had gotten into a fight with another oh, boy yeah. and my mom caught wind of this and went no, over. I, I saw my brother, he got hurt. This well, guy was like beating wind of him it. up. Yeah. Went over and kicked yeah. his, you know what, and broke his leg, was it? No. Or his arm. I don't remember breaking a bone. You broke Tasha. a bone. Oh God! Don't I've tell I've, me that. I've known this story my whole life. Well, that's something that Lee shared with you. I don't remember any broken bone, but I did. <laughs> he did get hurt. The guy did get hurt, yeah. but he had hurt my brother, and I saw it, and I was like, not having a part of that. And elementary that, school kids. Elementary yes, school and then kids my brothers too. got bigger, and then yeah, and then we or used an, to fight. And that, another really fun story I remember oh, from gosh. when they were in elementary school. <laughs> going once, going twice. Anyone in? We got sold thirty-three dollars. <laughs> I'm going to say sold to MJ. Well, at oh, oh, Lisa. Lisa. Okay. Boom, boom. Sold. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. My other favorite story that I oh, heard about gosh. them when they were kids was when I think my mom was in like kindergarten. My Uncle Lee was even younger than that. And my Uncle oh, Tony no. was one okay. year older. And they all broke into their school. No. My brother Lee took the keys out of his uh, teacher's purse on a Friday and on Saturday morning, I didn't know anything about it. And we lived three houses across the street from the school. And my brother was like, come on, we were going to go roller skating over in the school grounds. So we did. It was a weekend. No one was there. And my brother had the key and got into the school. And yeah, we don't talk about, yeah, that was just killed ch children misbehaving. We, yeah, my brothers were bad, and I was right in the middle of it because one was just above me and one was just below me as age. I was in the middle. My other brother lived with his mom or my dad. Um, 
Okay, we got MJ. <laughs> Tasha telling my childhood horror stories. Jeez. MJ <laughs> Hoagie. <laughs> At 31. She wants to I don't even know what that is. Tree tree ring. Tree of life. Yeah, I do I do share quite a bit, but oh that felt weird. You're talking about Yeah, my brothers are really bad. They, oh, they did it feels a lot of weird because I'm talking about her, but she's always oh, over here talking yeah, about me. I was me. talking about her yesterday, wasn't I? She's like, Mom, that's my private business. And I'm like, Well, I understand. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's just start this music note for five bucks. It's Sterling. Just, just one let's just let's just change the subject. <laughs> just <laughs> right? Okay. Yeah. Okay. This is twenty inches long, guys. Anyone that really likes music, I'm just gonna start this sweet little thing at five. Thank you, Kathy, because we want to get off this subject and move on. Some I, of us. I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> I um I feel dirty. <laughs> oh my goodness. SB five. Why does this say what? Like eight hundred on it. Oh, is that what it says? I don't know. It looks like eight zero zero. Well it could it be also eight hundred. Um it does say eight hundred. It says eight hundred eight hundred stir. So that's a vintage, um it's actually a vintage one because it does say stir right at the top. It's made of 800 silver. The chain itself, though, is sterling silver. Um, it would be 925, not um, chain literate. Thank God we didn't have the internet. <laughs> the secrets are buried and gone. Right? My niece is so music. Oh, awesome. Yeah, this is, um, oh, it's got a little M and a cleft thing, and it says 925, mm -hmm. or uh, 925 Italy, and... It's marked on the bale and everywhere. And if you want to test that real quick, Tasha. Of course. Yeah. Why don't you test that for the lovely I'll people test. I'll test out the here in YouTube land. And I'm going to test the charm right here. Yeah. Oh, and, so, and it goes on like butter. Yeah. It'll, um, it'll still come up. It's just not going to be as vibrant blue as the other. I'm going to test this chain right here. My 89-year-old mom is in a band oh that is so what? rocking topaz jim that's amazing my grandmother played tennis um until she was 80 years old every day um and then she started getting uh some dementia and having some issues and yeah they both actually fired up like they were sterling silver so it says 800 on there but they're both Firing it light blue like they should. Out to Topaz. Your mom deserves it. Aww. Topaz. Oh, that's so nice of you, Kathy. Aww. So what is your grandmother doing the band? Now I'm curious. That's oh. awesome. And I want to see her. She yeah. Oh, my God. A drummer. Pink spiky hair. Pink spiky hair. Tasha, go camera up. Sell something to the people and tell them how much you love them. Hi, guys. Love you. Here. Pick out a real awesome ring. She loves ring. to put me on the spot. Just pick out a real awesome ring and, and take care of these lovely people. I'm going to go use the ladies' room, and we may call it a night soon, right? I, I think we may. Yeah. I think so, too. I got to finish writing this. Topaz got this music note necklace. For $11. Topaz Gem 11, and you got it for 11. Look at that. Lucky. All right, guys. Well, let's see. Do you want another ring? What do you think? I think we should do another ring. What do you think, Marissa? Sure. Sure, she says. All right. I'm going to go ahead and start with this one. She's really pretty. She plays the Play flute. The flute. So That's precious. <laughs> I need to see this. Oh, that's sweet. Okay. So I have this very pretty ring. 
It reminds me of a butterfly. I'm not sure if that's exactly what it's supposed to be because it's not perfectly symmetrical. Learned that word in the kindergarten. I remember learning that word and coming home so excited because I knew this big word and I told my mom, symmetrical. It's not perfectly symmetrical. So I don't know if it's supposed to be a butterfly or if it is just a little swirly thing. Either way, it's very cute. It fits very well. It fits this finger, which is actually a pretty large size finger, I would say. According to this mandrel, it says it is a size seven. Oh, that's a real pretty one. I like it. I, I like the little swirly do's on here. And I the do little, too. I like little it. It's black just very dots. fluid. It is very fluid. Butterfly-like, I, I think. Yeah, um, very butterfly-like. Is it? I don't um, see any Is it marks. a bypass ring? I don't know what a bypass ring is. No, it is not. It looks like it was made as a bypass ring, and then they added the little beads down the center there, and it all got welded together. Because you see there, it could have been a bypass ring. So because this ring has no markings on it, I'm definitely going to test this one. You need to share a picture of her plane. That would be amazing. I'd love to see that. I would love that. to see that. I would so Maybe love even to a see video. That. Is she on YouTube? We'll find her. Right? Yes. Please share. Please do share. That's it goes so on awesome. nice and smooth. Just like butter. Like butter. That's a neat one. Ooh, that one fits me it nicely. Fits super nice. Yeah, it, it just hugs the finger, like immediately holds onto you. It doesn't go anywhere. It's not moving. It's a neat ring. You can see it lighting up blue. So this is definitely going to be sterling silver. That's definitely like an artisan type made piece there. I would think so too because yeah. it's not marked. It, I mean, it's a very Can simple design. In this chat, on second thought. I would, would be love to see that, but I that don't would know. Be pretty chaotic. I've often wondered that too because I've wanted to share pictures. Like when people are talking about something, I'm like, oh, I have that. I wanted to throw the picture in. I'm like, how do I do that? I don't think there's any marks or any names in there. There's nope. not. It's just made. Someone had. Um, so what they do is they'll melt like a. They'll take silver, melt it down, and they put it into this, it's called a crucible. They melt it down, and then you've got a slab, and then they'll like pound it out. They put it in this machine that actually it, you can end up making this right here, just that round, perfect thing. It's a machine. It pulls the metal through. It pulls the metal through. If you've never seen the process, it's pretty cool. So they just started with probably a piece of wire this long did their little design and melted their little dots on top and just simple sweet but handmade handmade piece really nice what do we start this in now how about twenty dollars on this one okay we're gonna do a starting bid of twenty dollars that's what the boss says it's sterling a silver extrusion process yes it's so very cool to watch the process. I really enjoy that type of thing. It's um, it's really neat. Extrusion, yeah, extrusion process. That was what you said. Yeah. Yes. It's such a neat word though. Extrusion. 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 We have a starting bid of twenty dollars on. Hello, Rose. Hi, Welcome. Rose. Nice to see you again. We are just talking about this lovely little ring here. You see a butterfly very much so. I thought it was a butterfly when I picked it up this afternoon. I, I definitely see the butterfly. Yeah. And, and it looks like a little caterpillar body, so. Oh, caterpillar body in the middle. Very cute. All right. We have a starting bet of $20 if anyone would like to jump in on this one. If not, we That's all right. are going once back into Mama T's closet. We're going to head and go twice. And into... we are. It, it looks, looks like, like they're, they're making, making silver spaghetti. <laughs> yes. It sure Sold. does. Sold. Back to okay. our closet. Bing, bing, bing. I'll just take that one back, guys. We're going to start something else then. One more and then we're done. One and done. All right. You Let's do something vintage. Grand finale. The grand oh, finale. Oh, no. I know what we can do. Tasha, we're going to do this one here. I, I got the drum roll going. We're going to do this here. I had tried to sell this prior. Um, it was one of those 
um, never got payment kind of things for. It is Larimar, Sterling Silver, and Snakeskin. And it's quite lovely. And it's marked just in there, 925. It's in pristine condition with the leather. There's absolutely, and, and the snakes, or the, uh, yeah, what is this? Uh, what's it called, Tasha? Eel skin? No. Eels? This is snake skin, right? Or is it eel? I mean, it, it could be snake skin without the scales. It does look Yeah, like it snake. looks more like snake to me. Actually, growing up, what did we have, Tasha? What did my brothers have? <laughs> we had all the snakes. I, we, we had an 18-foot boa constrictor. Her name was Squeeze. It was Burmese python, not boa. I thought it was a boa constrictor. Oh, no, the albino one was a boa constrictor. Yes, yes. It, we had a 14-foot albino boa constrictor. Yes. We had a rattlesnake. had an <laughs> African iguana, which was really cool because it was black and white. But whenever, like, she was nervous or would get frustrated, all the white parts on her would turn bright orange. Yeah, we had a golden tegu that lived in the house. It just, like, lived in the plants and stuff. We actually had a, um, a green uh, tree snake that lived in a ficus tree we had. You also squeeze, when you were in... yeah. His name was Squeeze. Uh, he got out one time, and the police came, and they had a gun pointed at it. They were going to shoot him because he was so big, and they didn't know what to do. Well, she, and, she got out multiple times. Yeah, she was on the news. Um, the, the, there was and, one time. It was so funny. What are we going to start this one out? We're going to start this one. one. We're going to start this at the same. Uh, it's an awesome cuff. It's awesome. That looks nice on anything, especially for winter. I like this a lot. We're going to go a starting bid on this one. This I'm going to start this one at 25, guys. Um, all, all of those animals were definitely my Uncle Lee. Um, my yeah. Uncle Lee and my Uncle Tony, they like to go fishing a lot, and that's how we acquired the rattlesnake. One of them caught it while they were out fishing and had it for years. And every time you'd walk into the garage, you would just hear its little rattle go. Pretty cool. Um, I was at work one day when I was in the grocery and I went into the lunch break room and I was watching on the news. They had the news on and I saw this house and um, it was a fire and they were talking about this fire and whatever. It was it was my mom's this house. Was it was the saddest day. Yeah, it was my mom's house. It was the garage. It was a detached garage and the heated blanket. It was during the winter time. One of the heated blankets tripped a wire. For squeeze the big one um the garage caught on fire we lost all the animals and they had to put squeeze out of his misery because he was so severely burned but she he, she came out she came out she she keeps calling him a boy but it was, a oh, girl. it was a girl she she came out though but her whole body was completely charcoal so then we actually had to put her down yeah and then the albino the one, albino one my friend took that one and and got it back to um what's that can you tell me what the center is made of please that's larimar and sterling silver it's larimar sterling silver i used to all through elementary school whenever we had show and tell squeeze was my show and tell every single time <laughs> i got pictures of tasha right next to squeeze she's in her diaper holding a bottle like oh, drinking her actually, baby bottle or she has that picture and squeeze is eating a live chicken right next to her in my mom's backyard <laughs> well here's a picture oh. there's me in the bottle and there's yeah, squeeze that's wrapped squeeze, around the chicken yeah that's my background on my when phone. he was small or when squeeze was much smaller yeah because but by small i mean she was probably like 13 feet right there yeah 12 13 feet okay so we're growing once for 27 dollars bridget money looking for 29. that can be some good um trivia questions for later mm -hmm. next time what? so today's going to end our marathon guys um we are going to take a few days off um to do mm -hmm. shipping and regroup i need to get a shipping a real good shipping station going for storage, because right now I've got boxes all over my yeah, living room. Lisa for 29. Yeah. And so, um, 
And then after I do the shipping and stuff, I still have a ton of stuff around me, guys, that I never got to um, when everyone's schedule is back on. And I think what we're going to do moving forward, whatever sales we do during the week, I'm going to just do shipping at, at the end of the week. Um, I'll do shipping like if I start on Monday, I'll do shipping the following Monday and we can do combined shipping through the week for you guys. Same way we've been doing this whole thing here just to keep it simple for you guys and to keep me out of, um, I mean, if we get pirate ship and they can come pick up our packages right here at the door, just like once we get that stuff down, it'll be a little different. But for now, I think um, shipping once a week, a lot of people have suggested it. I like it. You guys get combined shipping on all these things, so. Yeah. Bridget Bunny in at 35. And yeah. Miller, it's you're beautiful. back. Hi, D. Yeah, we saw you left. You probably went and had dinner or something, I'd I'm imagine. Hungry. We're probably going to eat soon. I'm sure. Isn't that neat? I just love this. And D, if you haven't seen, this is Snakeskin Laramar Sterling Silver Feeding the Bear. Oh. He's a bear. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me of Bridesmaids. Oh, I, that I think, movie I think is it's hilarious. Melissa McCart McCarthy. McCarthy. Yeah, my little tidbit the other day, I said Jennifer McCarthy, and I meant Melissa McCarthy. Yeah. I don't remember that part. What move? What part of that movie? With with good night, everyone. Our good night makeup. Zombie Liz, we'll see you soon. She's feeding her boyfriend a big sandwich. I don't remember. Okay, $35 going once to Bridget Benny. Isn't that beautiful? I really like that. I like that a lot. I did sport that once or twice, I must admit. I cannot tell a lie. I knew Dee would like that. D likes that. It's beauty. It's a beauty. And it, it seems very flexible, so it can, you know, you can do up or down. Bridget Benny likes it a lot too, D. She said, oh, but I really like it. it. It's very nice. Just perfect on the inside, the shape. It's pristine condition. Yeah. It's a nice piece. $39 looking for $41. Baru, baru, baru. D said, yes, yes, yes. I like it. I like oh, D. Ooh, that might look great with the onyx. The nice onyx pendant. D said, yes, it would. We're at $41, looking for $43. $43, ladies. Very nice. <coughs> oh, Bridget said, yes, I do. Yes, I will, she says. D, this may be the last thing we're doing tonight, though, because we didn't realize we've been here three hours already. I mean, I guess we came on at three. We've been here three and a half hours. I didn't. I, I wasn't really, okay, you, you did hear. Yeah, I wasn't really sure. Um, I, I mean, I didn't know. I didn't know we were here this long. It's a battle royale. We got 43 at Bridget Benny looking for 45. Going once. So 43 for Bridget Benny. Have laundry, heat up leftovers, feed dishes. <laughs> feed and dishes, D says. And 45, I'll take it. Yeah, she said, yeah. I get that. That's how I was yesterday. I was trying to watch everyone after our little live. And I'm, I was running around the house. I had the laptop, or not the laptop, my little thing going, my, te my phone going. I was moving it around, trying to do stuff around the house and carry my phone. Out to D. Going once, going twice, and so Congratulations, to D. D. Miller. Thank you, my dear. 
All right, we got D Miller in at 45. That's a lovely piece. 45 Laramar. Just lovely. It's just beautiful is what it is. Gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. Yes, D. Gorgeous piece. Gorgeous. All right. Tasha and I would just like to say thank you guys for all you have. Um, you have just embraced us and filled our hearts with love and happiness and joy and all kinds of good stuff. Oh, yes. And it feels so good and we love it and we can't get enough of it. And we just love you guys. Thank you so, so much for all of you for coming in um, and participating. It's yeah. it's an awesome, this is like best job I ever had. It's so fun. Just right? to get here and like get to hang out with you guys. Yes, I you. was it's asking her, you know, I was like asking her, talking to her about it today. I'm like, do you really like it? And she's like, mom, I really like it. I have so much fun. It's fun. I like it. I like getting to know people. And then she said her little thing that she said to me that I shared with one of you. Yeah, it's neat. It's such a neat, um, such a neat group. You guys are awesome. Thank you, Rose. Thank you for coming. Good night, MJ Hoagie, Bridget Bunny, Linda Cook, D Miller, Topaz Gem Eleven, Kathy, Bridget. Who else? Anna. Uh -huh. Hi, Anna. I didn't even say hi to you, Kathy. Bridget D. Lisa F. Lois B. Liz, Lois B, my buddy, Bridget Bunny. Who else is here? There's a lot of you guys here. Well, we sure love you, and we thank you, and let's go back down to the end here. Good night, all. You guys have a wonderful, blessed night. Um, I'll be sending out shipping. We're going to do invoices, like, right away. Please get everything paid so we can do all the shipping tomorrow. I think we still have a couple small requests for a couple of items from slash yesterday's thing. Um, oh, good night, Jane. Thank you, Jane. Double T. Ah, oh, I like that. Double T's treasures. Double T. Double T treasures. Double T treasures. I don't know. We'll come up with something. I, I like it. I like it. I like it too. But double T kind of sounds like double so much tree. fun. Well, thank you, Crazy Mary Stash. Oh gosh, look at that. I better flip that back. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> Love you guys. We'll see you. Um, I'll see you in a few days. We're gonna do lots of shipping. Boom. Um, if you've only ordered a small amount, we're gonna send a little crust for like five bucks for the shipping cost. Um, everyone in the United States. If you ordered over 200, your shipping is free. Jane, she's one of those ones in Canada. I got you half. Got you covered there. And uh, yeah, little little subsidies here from the United States to help with the cost there <laughs> for those shipping costs. Um, and I think everybody else is good. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I don't even know what I'm saying. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think I need um need some, some food. sleep. Some food, some sleep. And some ice cream. Ice cream. Chocolate. I love ice cream. Chocolate. Chocolate? You mm, usually always want strawberry, want... so that's shocking. Oh well uh, yeah. When it comes to ice cream, I want strawberry. When it comes to chocolate, I just want chocolate, you right? Just want chocolate. I want ice cream. Yeah. No. When I want sweets, I want ice cream. Like I don't care how oh, cold no. it is outside, I want ice cream. Uh, you know what my favorite is? Baskin Robbins. Very, what is it? Very, very berry strawberry ice cream with pineapple chunks. Milkshake. Every time. Mm -hmm. Since I was a kid. My fave. Good night, guys. Thank you so much. Love you guys. See you soon. Good night. We're going to get this stuff shipped out like ASAP. Also, that Woo! sounds like a trivia question, so try to remember yeah, that one. Yeah, remember those. See you guys. See ya.